fucking do it again. Okay, I'm ready to go now. Don't need to wait for the countdown. I am ready, steady, to go. <laughs> You're not wrong, Eggy. You're not wrong. First. Then we can go. Okay. You're not wrong, Eggy. How you doing, Eggy? Something I um think would be cool is if I end up doing this level this level and then this level today but I doubt I will but if I do that'll be cool I have those crystals down there like hidden from the very start I just don't see them oh you can kind of see them there Yeah. You can even see the little phone booth there. Oh, I didn't realize that. So much detail in this mountain. In this section. Gondola to the mirror temple. 
You've been eh, didn't stream today because I just couldn't muster the energy. Always makes me feel bad uh, in a weird way, but I don't know. I understand completely, my friend. I understand absolutely completely. Damn, really? So that by the time we're there, we're in the second half. Okay, well, let's uh, let's just run through here and see if we can uh, remember the route. Hey, other streamer, how you doing? Welcome in, welcome in. Uh, yeah, I feel exactly the same way, Eggy. I am. Um... Okay, so I have to get this first and then. Okay. Then where do I go? Right, okay, I remember. <clears throat> I'm doing not so bad. Could be better, but you know, not so bad. Uh, is the key down here? Forget where the key was. Down here, is it? That's death. I feel like I don't even have to go this direction. I just need to go up, I think. I just need to go up here. Yeah, there's the key. Of which I need to go that way for. How you doing, Rodar? Did you, uh... Did you like the, uh, the clip I sent you? I thought it was hilarious. <laughs> but yeah, so I just need to get up there, okay. And then I've got the key. Okay, that's all I have to do. Shortcut? No. I'm scared to ask how it came up. Um, so I was talking to her about, okay, yeah, that's just where I need to go. Okay. I was talking to her about, um, to Juniper about, uh, we're just talking and she said, you know, like I talk about very interesting topics, bigger questions and whatnot. Cause I was asking her, like I was asking her about a model and, uh, no one had asked her about it before and I was surprised. I said, oh, if you really want the big questions, we need to ask. <laughs> what does Rhoda smell like? <coughs> and <coughs> excuse me and uh it uh turned out you you smell like leather apparently oh. so uh okay yeah i can just get this way Remember correctly. But yeah, so this is where it is. Okay, I need a key, and then I need to go this way. And so, uh, yeah, we uh, we figured out that you smell like you smell like leather. And then I was asking, what kind of leather, though? We need to know these details. We need to know clearly. And uh, yeah, that's just a very. To 
remembering the route is really annoying, man. Okay, looks like I just need to come from below. No, I can't come from below. Okay. I don't remember how to get this damn key. Okay. So we gotta go there. Okay, I can kind of see where I gotta go. I gotta save my dash. Go. Damn, man, you gotta do that in one. Okay, so you can grab that wall. Right, that's easy. Remembering where you gotta go here <laughs> sucks ass. <laughs> Got it, okay. Nice, nice. How are you doing, Rhoda? Are you doing uh, all right today? Oh my god, I thought I missed it. It's a big hole, it's hard to miss. Okay. Right. Now with this key, we can skip that door and just go straight to the next. I think we're in the big room, right? Yeah, now we're in the big room. Oh no, we're not. Wait, do we keep the key into the next room? Or can I just skip this key that I got all together? Because if I can take this key with me, that'll probably be easier. Hmm. Doing alright, except for a bad case of Sunday night blues. Ah, you got the Sunday night blues already? Well, I guess it is further in the night, isn't it? Damn, that's too bad, man. Almost 9pm, yeah. Here's a question I have. I kill myself with this thing. Does that mean... I have to restart the golden berry? I wouldn't imagine so. I, th I think you have to do it. Oh, that's such a cool sound effect. Dude, this level's so cool. Something I've come to realize, and I kind of realized it when I was playing uh, through the game after this level on reflection This level is Is realistically the reflection level you meant to come through the temple and have some reflection But uh, Madeline doesn't see it that way Okay, I see Oh shit Well, I fucked up so I've got a... Do that. Okay. Okay. 
glad those guys' hitboxes are a bit better than the uh, snowballs. I don't want that. Go away. Oh, you son of a bitch, I jumped. I should have just dashed through. <laughs> See ya, buddy. These guys aren't too bad. Bye bye. That's easy. Ho 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 ho, he was coming for me. Okay, uh... Yeah, okay. Easy peasy, baby. So I don't get to keep the key, so I could probably just skip that entire section at the uh, at the start there. Ah, oh, the music in this particular stage is absolutely unraveling. It is. It's meant to be. It's completely meant to be. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I was hoping I could keep the key for here, but that's fine. We can just. Do it the regular way. Damn it, I didn't want to activate you. Hey, note to self, don't go that way. Good. Obvious. Alright, so I do remember this, and all I need to do to get the key, realistically, is just go... Not even this way, it's down here. I just have to go here. I think this is where I had to go. No, I did have to go up there. Oh, well, I went the wrong way. Did I? Go back. Stand there. This doesn't look right. Where the hell's the key? Mr. Key. Oh, there it is. Okay, yeah, I did have to go around. Okay. So, yeah, it is the top way. Hey, buddy. darkness in this level makes it so hard to see. Um, so I can go this way for a key. I know I can. The question is, do I want to? I don't think I want to. I think the other key is just easier to get. This key. All right here. Oh wait, this isn't a key. Didn't duck? Okay. This isn't a key, never mind. Uh leave this. Is this the key?
I honestly do not remember where the hell these keys are. Okay, here it is. Okay, yeah, that was easy. Two keys, that's all I need. This level is long, but it's not too bad. It's not like the, um... It's not like the, uh... The hotel where, like, everything is practically stacked against you. Oh, oh, okay. He came right for me. Okay, so when I drop down here, just move to the right. Ah, see ya, buddy. Alright, we're nearly at Theo. Okay, we just need to get past him. Okay. See you, buddy. <gasps> nope. Oh, I nearly fell. Okay. Okay, I don't think it matters which way I go here. There's a button somewhere. There, probably. Yeah. Oh, I bounced right into him. Okay. What do is I do this? No, that don't work. Okay. We. So when's the Obra Din? The Obra Din will be after Code Vein. Okay, yeah, there we go. Now we're up to Theo. Obra Din will be after Theo. Um, it'll be um. Damn, girl, you can live. I like Theo. Theo's cool. <laughs> It'll be after um, Code Vein. It'll be an in between game between Code Vein. Oh, I didn't land on his head. Damn it. Okay. Ah! Looking forward to that one? Yeah, I can't wait to do it too. It's gonna be fun. There we go, bounce on his head that time. I think for these sections, I'm just gonna take it a bit slower when I'm, uh... when I'm carrying Theo around. If I can get through here fairly simply, that would be good. Oh, come on. <laughs> I tried to bonk on his head. Butterfingers, how you doing? How's you doing, friend? Ah! I was gonna say, if that killed me, that would have been really annoying. Ah! Oh, okay, how do I get that angle? With Theo. How you doing, Butterfingers?
Whoa. Oh, what? Oh, wait, I didn't have to hit that button. Oh, okay. I'm dumb. Okay, I just had to walk across. Oh, good. How are you doing? I kind of woke up a little... A little, uh, tired. I slept for a... I slept for a too long last night. Theo saves the day again. But I'm doing alright. I, I want to get through some more Celeste and, uh... And, uh, see how we go from there, you know? Dear yeah, fellas, okay, good. There's no buttons to press there. Oh my god, oh my god, he bumped me in. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh shit, wait, okay. I see what I gotta do. Fuck. <laughs> Ow! Tomato Nato, what you doing, man? That hurt. Oh, I didn't. Okay, so I gotta jump. Oh, like... <sighs> okay, that's too far. How you doing, Tomato Nato? Oh, seriously? That works. Well, look who it is. <laughs> I have to be close. I feel it. <laughs> oh shit, that door's closed. Oh. <laughs> okay, I think this is the end. I don't think there's anything else, right? through. Alright, Theo, you gotta kill your own eyeball. Ooh, I'm doing alright. I'm doing very, very good. I had a bit of a poor sleep, but you know, it is what it is. Gotcha. Will you keep playing the game in the future? Celeste? Yes, yes. Uh, Butterfingers, I, I forget if you recall me saying, but when I'm, uh, after I get all the other golden berries and I'm up to farewell golden berry, I will be streaming farewell golden berry when I feel like I am very close to, like, getting it. So, when that time comes, I, you will see some more Celeste from me, but until then, you know, I'm gonna move on to other games and just do the golden berries off stream. Although I am kind of sad to stop streaming Celeste, because I do really enjoy this game. If it wasn't for the sheer fact that I just have so many games I want to get through, you know? Oh, you think that's painful, Tomatoinator? I have to do this whole level in one life. <laughs> Let me run through the level one more time, just to make sure I got the, the route down. How you doing, dude? Good, how are you? This looks pain painful. <laughs> yeah, I gotta do this whole thing in one life. So I got the rat down, I think, now. <gasps> well, not that. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Bro, really? Yeah, really? Gotta do it one life. Although, this temple, I, I'm kind of skipping like 80% of it because I don't have to get any strawberries. Oh. Alright, got the key.
Ooh. Please share your progress. Oh yeah, I whenever I get a golden berry, I'll be posting it in my Discord. 100%. Okay, so as long as I know the route through the level now, that's that's all that matters. Okay, so from here I need to go up. Oh no, wait, I don't have to do anything here. I can just skip this whole section. Bano? Is this where I can skip it? Uh, I think this is where I can skip it. Yeah, I skipped that whole section and then I can skip this section as well. Yeah, I can skip this section. Yep, skip that. I love that about this game, where you can just outrightly skip sections because, you know, you don't need to do them. It's so good. Okay. Tomato Nader, do you like uh, platformers, 2D or 3D? This is probably one of the best uh, 2D platformers you can get out there these days. Okay, now from here, I just need to go up. You do? Yeah, if you like 2D platformers, this game I highly recommend to you. Oh, I missed it. Can I skip this? No, I can't. Okay. Uh, Butterfingers, you probably know this, but if I kill myself here with the Golden Berry, it's fine, right? Yeah, this game here, uh, Tomato Nata, I think takes the cake over, like, Super Meat Boy and, and games like that. It's harsh, but fair gameplay. Yeah, so when I die there, I shouldn't die die, should I? Yeah, it's intended. Okay, yeah, cool. Look at this backdrop. Oh, it's so cool. And the sound effects. Oh. Back here battling. I'll skip all the cutscenes for you, Tomato Nato, because one, I want to skip them anyway, but two, uh, I don't want to spoil any of the story for you if you do end up playing it. Cool. But this game is honestly really, really cool. Shit. Ah! Fuck! I tried to... <laughs> it kind of works. See, buddy. I wanted to like hyper dash. <gasps> that was not the direction I pressed. Should have just hugged the wall. That worked. Oh my god. Okay. I don't know if that will work every time, but it worked that time. Tried to jump down. <laughs> Shit! I was in slow mode for so long. Ah! That's what I wanted to do. Yeah, don't aggressive me. That's not what I wanted. Ooh. Come on over here. Yeah, that's it. There you go. Good boy, good boy. Right, skip that cutscene.
I love that you can just skip sections of this level. Despite its complexity, you can just outrightly skip them. Oh, wait. I didn't want to do that. Wait, can I do that? Could, to... Oh, no. It doesn't matter. Okay. Uh, uh, let's see here. Up. Probably the worst part about this level is just the fact that you can't see Jack. I need you up here. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. There's a section on the B side uh, that the Seeker collects all the coins for you if you just wait five seconds. Really? Is that the one where the coin is in like the corner? It's like surrounded by spikes. You can skip a big chunk of this level. The whole maze you can skip. Wait, you can skip this part, can you? If I can skip this part, let me know, because it'd be nice to know the skip. It's like a diamond pattern. See, I'm going this way now to try and just get past a lot of the... Uh... Oh, so I can skip this part. Well, farewell. Catch a tomato nader. Unless that you knew that that was the name of farewell. Uh, last level, but yeah, catch it, dude. Take it easy. Thanks for popping in. It was good to see you again. Oh. Go left most. Okay, yeah. Oh, wait. Yeah, I have hyper dash now, so I could just maybe. Oh, well, that's a. Did I just hyper dash past this point? You need a reverse hyper. A reverse hyper? What the hell is that? The hell? Although I think I've seen that before. It's where you like go down like that. I think I've seen a YouTube video of, a, of when Sawtex first showed me. Sawtex showed me uh, how to... He was showing me a, a modded level and the guy would like dashed into the ground and went backwards. Like that. You can dash right direction then press left and jump. Like that. But like obviously the other direction. Okay. So I do it here, correct? Ah! <laughs> ah! Yes, you could do it grounded as well. Oh, you could do it grounded as well. Like that. Oh, okay, and I get my... But how do I... How do I get my dash back? Oh, okay, I see, I see. If you could do it grounded, how do you get your dash back if you're grounded? Or do I gotta do it backwards? Oh, I see. Ah, I see, I see. Ah, I bonked myself. So if I do it grounded, but go backwards. Okay. Ah! Can I just do it from the... Do I have to do it on that little platform, or can I do it here? You dash to the right first. Uh, when you're dashing, you press left and jump. On the small platform. Okay, on the small platform. Oh, I did it, but I, I bonked the thing. Okay, I see. Learning more techniques. Ah! I keep bonking it. Damn it. Why does this platform here have to have the spikes as well?
This is cool. I like this. I like this. Although it'd probably be just as easy to get all the keys. Hmm. I'm, lo I'm not being able to... Like, I could do it up here. Wait, maybe it's just a matter of distance. Oh. Yeah, I think it's a bit of distance. Okay, I need to be a bit more left. Nope. I don't even know how I touched that, so... This is a cool technique. It comes down to the timing. Yeah... I think this is cool, but I think I... I think it's too much for what I want to do for Goldenberry. If I had a... Like... If I... Outside of streaming, if I practiced this and, you know, I wanted to do that, then... Like, that... That's cool. I like that. Though I don't keep... I... Am not keeping my... Okay, yeah. That time I get my dash. Okay, I see. I'm gonna practice it this way. I think my... I think my controller might actually just be scuffed. Because I can do it the other way. Because it looks like I'm doing like little bunny hops instead of like actually going in the direction. But when I do it this way, I can do it every time. It might be my controller. Because I can do it this direction. Like, almost every time. But I can't do it in this direction. I think it's my... I think it's my controller. I can sometimes get it. Yeah. Yeah, I think my controller's a bit scuffed. And I've been saying it for a couple days now, but I think that's proof of it. Like... <laughs> I can, I can do it just about every time this direction, but I can't do it the other direction. The direction I need to go. I don't think it's because I'm down there either. Like, if I do it here, it's... <laughs> I think, yeah, I think my... I left my... Le I think my left D-pad button is a bit scuffed. Because I can sometimes get it. Oh, wait, here we go. Maybe if I... Nope. Maybe I'm just completely mistiming it. What if I just... Okay, okay. No, no. Okay. Okay, I'm getting it down a bit more. I have to do it faster than I do the other direction. Nope. Because this direction, I have a bit of leeway. But... This direction, I don't. Okay, okay. I think I've got it a bit better. Despite my controller. Damn it. I bonked it. Yeah, I, I think it might just be worth doing it the proper way just for this. Uh, I do need a better... I do need a new controller. I think I'm going to get a PS5 controller next rather than a PS4. Although I'm still waiting on those damn buttons to come through so I can fix my PS4 controller. I'm trying to do Super instead... Uh, don't press down. Like that. Just straight right, then dash. Like that. Let me try that. That seems to give me... Ooh, if I had have gotten my... If I had have gotten my hair back, I would have done that. Ah. Just click the right buttons. But I need to click the left buttons. <gasps> oh, I pressed the wrong dash. Ah. Why'd I do that? Oh, didn't keep my hair. Okay, so it looks like I need to touch the other wall and then bounce. Oh, I like that though. Oh, I did it! Oh, hell yeah! That was close. Oh my god. Let's 
try that again. If I can get it consistent a few times, then that'll be pretty neat. Okay, that worked better. Okay, so I need to do a diagonal dash. Okay, I did a diagonal dash out of, like, instinct, but I do have to do a diagonal dash. Ah, I just said I need to do a diagonal dash. <laughs> okay, let's try again. <laughs> no, 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 no. I don't want the door closed. Okay, we'll do it again. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> if I can see it, I can learn it, baby. Oh, I even saved myself, but I dashed into the, um... Let me get back to the other door. I didn't mean to go through this door. Well, that's neat. Neato burrito. Thank you for the, uh, for the advice, Butterfingers. Ah. I need to get it a bit more consistent, and then... Oh, that was close. Okay. There we go. Hey, yeah, I need to be like right against that. Oh, it's so good. Oh, that wasn't going to work. I don't know how long it's meant to take to, to practice this trick, but, uh... I think we've got a... <laughs> I think we've got a pretty good rhythm for it. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, I love this game so much. There's so many ways you can just... Ah, <gasps> oh, I didn't mean to do that. Well... There's so many ways you can just uh, approach the game, and I like that. Yeah, no, I've got to be like right against this wall. Go. Okay. I really like that. I think I got it consistent in five to ten minutes. Yeah, I, I don't think this one's the hardest technique to learn. I think the hardest technique I've had to learn so far was the um, the neutral wall jump uh, to keep your stamina. I think that was the hardest one I've learnt so far. I don't remember who taught me that. I think it was... It was someone who was in for that stream and another stream, but I haven't seen them since, so I kind of forget their name. Yeah, this is neat. I do still think that my controller's a bit scuffed up, but, uh, that's an issue for another day. Yeah, I think we got this down pretty pat. And if I die here, then, you know, it is what it is. I'm trying to do a skip. Okay, nice. Okay, so from here I need to drop and go right. Hey, buddy. It's more just this section now where I gotta fight these things that I'm worried. Haha! <laughs> Can't see me yet. Why? Oh, yeah, it's up here, isn't it? It climbed up and didn't... Uh, it's so annoying. You know what, I, could, I could probably just go like this, can't I? Ha! 
<laughs> Use all the momentum. I strongly dislike neutrals, uh, to say that it nicely. Yeah, I wasn't a big fan of it either. I, I can't say I was a big fan. I just realized there's those, those purple eyes in the background, the black and purple eyes. If the red eyes are Leo's, uh, Theo's, uh, fans, then the black ones are probably his haters, eh? If I had to guess. Oh, grab the wall. <laughs> oh, I didn't realize I couldn't jump that. God. <laughs> that, that brrr, I thought it was going to fly towards me. Ooh. Yeah, I'd rather go this way, to be honest. I still got the key. That's funny. Ah! Da -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba. Bad monster. Oh, I dashed right into it. Okay, so what do I do here? I gotta go up. I don't even really have to hit that button. I just need to... Okay. I don't need to throw him. I just need to... Jump over the thing. Okay, yeah, that's what I need to do. Over Badium. Ah, oh shit! <laughs> Get in there, Theo! No, oh, no, that's too far. Ah, okay. I guess the idea is you get on this block and then you. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Easy peasy, baby. Easy peasy. See you, fellas. Don't mind me. Oh, I killed it! <laughs> Suck it! You big ugly. Alright, and then the last room. Oh, no, <laughs> I should have thrown Theo. Oh. See ya, buddy. Sayonara. All right, now this is the last room. Okay. Oh, that nearly pushed me into the dam. Oh, okay. I think we've got the route down and we've got that skip down. So I think we, uh, we're we ready for it. I think we're ready for this uh, mirror temple. Oh, man. I wonder if you can die there. I, I assume you could to the doors. I would think it, you'd have to be very unlucky, though. So you can skip like 80% of this whole temple, which is pretty neat. Oh. I 
<laughs> Imagine you're doing the world record speed run and you're like, got good time. And then suddenly, oh wait, I know I don't need the key, do I? No, I don't. I don't need the key at all. Oh, I do need the key. This key I need, right. What if I... I do need this key, so... Get this one. This one's not too bad. So far, so good. Second chapter. Oh, yeah, I need to hit the door. We can skip this room. Just see how far I get before I die, because I'm sure I'm going to die. Just something stupid. Probably that skip, to be perfectly honest. Alright, we can skip this room. This level is way more intimidating than what it actually is. Like, once you know where to go, it's more or less fine. The biggest danger is, just like the snowballs, it's the end of the level where the monsters are. I probably died to something stupid gets the gold. <laughs> I don't know, man. I die to stupid all the time. But we are over halfway through the level already, which is pretty, pretty neat to see. I think this is the halfway point anyway. Knowing my luck, I'll probably hit the retry button accidentally. <clears throat> okay, thank God. <laughs> I was gonna say. I love that background as you fall down. Hey, Badalyn. I was saying at the start of the stream, uh, Butterfingers, that if I could somehow get this one, and then, and then, uh, uh, reflection, and then to end the stream on, uh, the mountaintop, that would be pretty cool. No, not even gonna lie. That would be a good final stream, I think. See ya, buddy. That's what I was trying to do last time. So this is PB, right? PB? Personal best? That may be asking a bit too much, uh, but who knows. It might be, yeah, I, I think it definitely is asking too much, but it would be cool. That's for sure.
<laughs> I was not risking anything with that guy. Nope. Okay. <laughs> nope. I don't like those things. Okay. Alright. We're up to the skip. Okay. Let's do the skip. Okay. Oh. <laughs> oh god, I was like <laughs> I was like pixel perfect there. Oh my god. Her ass could touch those fucking tendrils. Oh my god. Ooh. The first attempt at this level, I think we've come pretty pretty far. Not even lying. Past this guy, and then I'm at the end. What? No, sorry, this guy as well. Oh, this this is the one that I need to hit the uh, button with. I missed it. I missed it. Okay, that's 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 completely on me. I missed the button. That was completely on me. Nice haircut though. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> oh man, that was on me. I thought I hit the button. I went to go back for it. I should have just, uh, I should have just... I don't know why I didn't go forward there, but... I should have just, uh, like, retreated or progressed and then gone back. You know what I mean? But it's fine. It's fine. <gasps> get back there any second now. I need to just take my time with the monsters and not do anything stupid. It's not a speed run, but yeah, I know exactly. That's, uh, that's my biggest issue, is I, I get a bit too speedy when I know what I need to do, rather than just taking my time. <laughs> you caught me button and just reminded me of, um, Logan from Wolverine. Wolverine Logan. He says bub, though, not bud. It just reminded me of it, because that new Wolverine game's coming out, like, this year or next year, I think. There's a wall here, so I can't technically go off the edge if I speed through there. <gasps> oh, okay, okay. It's fine. Do you ever watch much of the X-Men? I watched it as a kid, you know? Like, I never read the comic books or anything, but, like... Comic books, they were big in Australia, just not as big as what they are in, like, America. I didn't know. Yeah, there's a new Wolverine game coming out. Uh, I forget who's making it, though. It looks cool. I watched the movies, not much the series. Yeah, same. I, uh, I... 
completely understand. I I, mo I mainly watched the 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 movies. I didn't really watch the uh I watched some of the cartoons growing up, but not many. Cuz like all the good cartoons like that were on um were on Cartoon Network and you had to pay for that here, so I never got to watch it. My family was poor. We couldn't afford TV. My family's still poor. <laughs> Alrighty. We're almost back to where we were. No letting... I don't need to hold a direction. If I press the direction, it shouldn't let go of me. Excuse me? And we're not going to pay extra for that. I think Heart to Network is the same bundled uh, with both standard cable plan for us. Oh, so you did have to pay for it there as well. Okay. I just got yeeted off the thing. That was BS, man. Probably better to just go down. Guess it doesn't matter. That we're not going to pay extra for that. Yeah, I... Hell, I don't even really want to pay extra for most of the things I get these days. Some things are more necessity than others. I am like... I'm in the boat of just apps outrightly cancelling my uh, my Netflix subscription because like I, I just never use it, man. There's no point in even having it. Like, why have something you're not using? That and Disney, my Disney one as well. Although my mum's using Disney, my Disney account. So we'll just uh, see how that goes. Because uh, I might just tell her to get her own because I'm I'm paying for it and not even using it myself. You know what the problem with uh with uh Netflix is? They put everything out there. And then everyone watches it, and then they've got nothing left to watch on it. You know, that whatever they want to watch. Like, I like the occasional, like, Korean or Japanese uh, film or TV series about, like, zombies or something. There was one that was called, um... I think it was a Korean one. It was, uh... Or a Japanese one. It was called, uh... Oh, God, what was it called? Uh, it was called something like Nobody Nobody Left Alive or something. And it was like... It was like, really good, but like, after it finished, it's like, well, I got nothing to watch now. <laughs> but the same, especially if now that everyone has their platform, it's kind of like cable again. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. I don't know. I, I think that, um... I think there was a time for it. There was some cool, unique shows on. But, like, now it's just like, eh. You could probably just watch the show somewhere else. I'm not going to say where, but you could probably watch it somewhere else. <laughs> I prefer having everything available. I can't stand waiting a week uh, like before. Well, see, I like that about Netflix, where everything's there, ready to go. Like, you've got the whole series there, ready for you. But, like... I don't know, there's, there's just something... about that, as well, that's like, well, once you... once you watch all the series, then... then what, you know? Don't see me. 
Hey, go back to your spawn. Go away. <sighs> like, I, that's the only good part about weekly, uh... Weekly... Waiting a week for an episode is that you, you'll go back to the... To the show for that very reason. Ah, uh, you didn't get it, you bastard. Oh boy. Alright. Go back to your spot. Yeah, that's it. Go away. <laughs> He's looking for me. Ugh, they're so ugly, man. Because I legit forgot about a series, uh, and just move on to something else. I understand, uh, like, something to look forward to every week. It depends on how long each episode is, too. I think in anime it works out pretty well. Because, uh... Because, uh, you can... You can really, um... Go that way. Cool. Because in anime, you can real it's only like 20 minutes an episode, and you can kind of get through the whole series in about three hours. You know, if you really want to binge something. Um, you know, usually 12 episodes per 20 minutes. Yeah. I don't know the exact time, but three hours sounds about right. Um, and you can uh, get through it pretty easily, but... An hour long per episode of series, it's like, uh That's gonna take a bit longer. Nice, I did it again. Very nice. Something to look forward to every week. Yeah, some series, yeah. Some series are definitely Crap, he followed me up. That's so ill, man. Ah, I missed it. <laughs> Stupid things. Have I gotten past that room? I did, I got past that room. I got to the, the next room. It was the furthest I've been so far. This is fine. I mean, it's it's par for the course to, uh, to have trouble with uh, the Goldens, right? Gotta love the Seekers. Seekers are definitely, uh, love is not the word I would use, but let's just go with it, sure. <laughs> I love these red bubbles. I'm glad that they came back in farewell. It's actually not even that far where I died. Like, it's not that hard to get back there. Other than the first set of Seekers I've got to go through beforehand, it's not that bad. I skipped most of the level. Uh, regardless of them. You know what I mean? Easy peasy, baby. Easy peasy. Oh, you mean to fall down here? Saves you three to five minutes. Yeah. But even these skips here, you know, like doing this skip here and the... And skip, just outrightly skipping like all the keys. You know, like this section here is mandatory. But, uh... Oh God. Oh, I survived that by the skin of my teeth. Oh my God. 
I like reacted rather than paying attention because I looked away for a second. <laughs> oh, that's something I, I, I need to remember to do that in my Discord is uh, ask everyone what B BTTV uh, emotes they'd like to see in the in the stream. That's definitely one I need to get. If I did do this golden berry first try, that would have been funny though. I can go up there. Ooh. I know that when I do farewell and even the next chapter when I have the feathers, I'm gonna have to start using the joystick. Because uh I, uh, I need to practice that for better direction for farewell. I would be happy if for you uh, if you had gotten it first try, but cry a little at the same time. Oh, man. Well, like, that's why I practiced it first, right? So that I could potentially... Damn it. So I could potentially do it, like, within a few attempts. I'm not taking any chances. I, I should just take my time with these guys. Okay. Oh boy. I, I want to get that one there first. So what I think I'll do is... Actually go... That one's done. The Goldens were criticized for going against the be proud of your death count motto. I mean, if you really think about it, well, depending on the person, how much they practice the level beforehand. I feel like people just, and I'm one of them, you know, like I, I would normally just hit the Golden first and see how far I get. And from there, I would actually normally practice if not just headstrong it through. But I feel like a lot of people just don't practice. Like, people forget the motto, practice makes perfect. And the point of the golden berry is to do it perfectly. Like, that that skip I just did there, I, I can do it, like, almost every time now because I practiced it. That's nothing unique to me. Shit. Followed me up. Oh my god. Okay. That's good. I don't know, I, I feel like it's also a, a matter of patience and, and a few other things, but yeah, I, I think people either don't have the patience or they just don't want to practice it and they want the golden berry like as soon as possible without any, with, with as minimal effort as possible. But sometimes it takes a good amount of effort to get things and that's what it means to be proud of your deaths because you put the effort in to overcome all the deaths for that one, that one attempt that got you to the end, you know? That was the opinion of your average player. Yeah. What we also have to remember is people are stupid. <laughs> Demi. 
Oh god, I hit a wall. I didn't know that wall was there. Oh my god. Okay, we're here. We're past the point of where I got stuck. Okay. Now we just gotta do this in one life. <laughs> no big, how you doing? How is uh, Kiva's uh, stream going? If she's still going when I'm done, I am gonna go raid her. I'm good there, bud. Nice, nice. You said it, not me. <laughs> hey, man, if people want to cry about things, then I'll point out why the, what they're <gasps> crying about is dumb. Damn it. Oh, round uh, seven, I think. <laughs> well, actually, you know what? I think I'm going to practice that last section. I think it'd be worthwhile practicing it and getting through it. I don't know, I was watch demo. Oh, his demo live as well. Let me go lurk in his, uh... Akiva's on B right back. Don't want to make fun of demo for me while I'm not there, alright? Okay. Yeah, the rest seems pretty straightforward, to be honest. Yeah, I think I've got the whole, like, start of the level down. It's just, I need to practice this end part, and then... Ask Demo about his controller. I I was there when he threw the controller. Uh, no big. I am more or less always in his streams. Unless I'm streaming at the same time. Get that out of my hand. How dare you. Ah, no! Oh, nope. I'm down here. Okay, good. He went up there. Thank God. Okay. Okay, I... I throw you there. Go up here. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I was there in his stream, uh, no big, when he threw his controller. Ah, uh, no, not that way. Okay. So this room, this is probably the room I have the most trouble with. I think it's the last room too. Oh, <laughs> he knocked it into me. Well, you, uh, Butterfingers, if you don't know, uh, them demo was doing, uh, was doing, um, if you know Hollow Knight, Path of Pain. And, uh, let's just say that it didn't turn out too well for him. Oh, damn, I was really hoping that would crush it. Yeah, <laughs> we crushed it. Nice. Oh, yeah, this room's pretty easy. <laughs> what happened? Yeah, see, he, he he did, he finished Path of Pain, but he hit the wall on the way down the drop. And uh, let's, <laughs> he, he wasn't happy after that. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, so I can't do that. It might be better if I just up. I want to try going up. Yeah, I don't like going up. Okay, 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 okay. That's... This room is a bit iffy. Let's just go hit the button. 
I thought I fell. Yeah, let's just hit the button and then we can uh, go around that way. Let's get the button first and then we can go back around and save Theo. Kill him there. Oh! Okay. It looks like you can throw Theo through the crystal. Wait, can Theo go through? He can. Okay, this is, isn't is actually too hard. Let me restart the chapter, do it again. 85 F degrees weather for seven hours make you so tired. Holy shit. Is 85 hot or cold? I don't know. Let me take a look. Uh, 85 F to C. Huh? That's like perfect temperature. What do you mean? The temperature here in Australia right now. Oh, it's 24 right now. I guess it is on the tail end of uh, summer. Summer's here. I'll tell you what it is in Fahrenheit. Summer's here uh, between 104 Fahrenheit and 113 Fahrenheit. <laughs> it depends on humidity. Though. Yeah, well, it's, it's blazing sun and huge humidity here. It's, it's just not fun. That's why I tell people if they're going to come to Australia, come in the winter. Summer sucks here. Everyone wants to come for that summer sun, but they don't realize just how fucking terrible it is. Regardless of humidity, it's way too hot. Yep. Okay. Nice. Oh, I did go under him. Oh my god, I went under him. Okay. I love that I can kill them if I can get them cornered like that. Oh, he jumped into me. Oh, okay, good. It didn't kill me. That with humidity and pushing 13 to 15 shopping carts uh, for, again, seven hours. Yeah, that does suck. If you're working in that, uh, I can completely understand why it sucks. I 100% understand because I had to work in the sun every day for nine years. Well, nearly every day for nine years. I had four weeks off, but... Oh, you fuck. He turned right at the last second. Oh, I jumped too early. Back in Florida, it would have been cold. Yeah, it depends on where you live, right? So, like, over there, like, your humidity is... Your your temperature slash humidity is, like, not that bad for me. But, like, for you, I can understand why it is. 100%. You f That guy threaded a needle to kill me. Oh my god. Nope, 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 nope. Haha. <laughs> See you, buddy. <laughs> Okay, so it's just the last room that I'm having a bit of issue with, it looks like. I can get through those rooms relatively okay, but this room here is... Ah, oh, dude, when he's, like, above me like that, it's so... I'm gonna kill him. Crush him. Ah, oh, I didn't crush him. Okay, 
let's let's do that again. We need this to be a bit more smooth. Quill, welcome in. How you doing, dude? How's you doing? 85 degrees Fahrenheit, Florida is bad. I I think it's just a uh I think the temperature wise, uh we're all used to something, you know, like, I don't think I would be that used to the cold. People who live close to zero degrees, like freezing temperatures. Oh, what, what am I doing? Yeah, I, I kind of cornered myself there. I got to pay attention. I can go under that, but I don't really want to. Okay, that was a fluke. In fact, I kind of want to just reset. Wait, would that crush me? Hmm. How you doing, Quell? Dude, that was such a fun uh, Resident Evil 4 stream you did uh, yesterday. I very much enjoyed it. If you guys don't know Quell, he's uh, he's new to streaming, but he's playing it through Resident Evil 4 right now. And uh, I, I've never played it, but I, I wanted to check it out. appeared so fast so I was like ready for it <laughs> it's weird that it doesn't dice him up it just like sent him flying I guess they couldn't show him getting nice. I clipped this yesterday <laughs> well, welcome in Quell I hope you're having a good day anything interesting happened today anything uh noteworthy I am practicing the... Oh, what am I doing? Okay, yeah. I am practicing the, the golden berry run that I need to do. I have to press a button? I do. There we go. Hey, buddy. Used his own explosion to knock me into the direction I needed to go. <laughs> oh, that was neat. Nope. Up! Oh, I should have gone up, not down. I thought he was going to hit the thing if I went down, but I couldn't go down. Okay. This room and the last room are my two most hated rooms so far. Oh god, that survived. <laughs> oh, he's, uh, he nibbled on my ass cheeks. Oh my god. He was touching me, man. Okay, so I can get a bit of momentum if I... Let's see if I can... Oh god, oh god, oh god. No, 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 no. Don't be trapped in there with me. I want you up there. Hey, buddy. Sayonara. What happens if I leave without him? That'd be funny. Alright, this room. Kill it. Okay. Over there. Oh, dude, stop. I need to just get this room down, Pat, I think. Well, that was unlucky. Maybe I just need to... What if I take him up the other direction? This might be easy, actually. I, I dashed into him. Oh. 
Not easier. Oh, well, he's totally pissed that he missed you there. Yeah, he was, but he got me in the end. This guy's such an ass. This one in this room in particular. Let me kill him here. Do Come over here. Their movement's a bit yike. Like that. Like that. back. Alright, I need a consistent kill him getting past this part. Go past. Yep, come back. Let me kill you. you I don't care if you're up there. It's fine. I'm gonna let him kill me. Jar so I can restart the room. It's so, so annoying. Past. No, why did you hit that? <laughs> well, that's one way to do it. Alright, come kill me. I don't care if you kill me. I don't care about the deaths. Right, what if I just don't... <laughs> I wish that could kill him. Oh, God, why did I keep picking it up? Okay, I think that's a better plan. Gotta go now. I work tomorrow. Good luck uh, in the attempt. I'll check the VOD. The rest of the VOD later, I wish you the best. If I do get the golden on this one, uh, Butterfingers, I will post something in the Discord and I'll tag you in it. Probably me getting it, okay? Um, but thanks so much for sticking around. Thank you for showing me that skip. Like, I really do appreciate it. That's, uh... It really helps, uh... Help, help, is gonna help me get through the level, you know? Okay, I think I've got a pretty consistent, uh, run here now. <laughs> yeah, bonk. Alright, kill me. Hey man, I really do appreciate it because I I don't know if I'd be able to do it on my own, you know? And that's what I love about communities is that... Now, I, I really just skipped him there. Is that you can uh, really build upon one another and I think that's what makes gaming so much fun. Just the interactions and building of a community. Wow, really? Oh my god. I can do this so easily now. Okay, I just need to bonk him at the start there. Or not. If I miss him, then I'll just let him go past. And then I could go in. Okay. I think I've got this down pretty pat. That is a great emote. <laughs> Get some good rest, better fingers, and uh, I hope work doesn't go for too long tomorrow. Okay, yeah. Oh, okay. I gotta not be greedy there. If he starts attacking me again... Okay, if I kill him there, I'm pretty much set. Yeah, I'm pretty much set if I kill him there. Bonk! If I don't, then I have to... Wait for him there. Yeah, no. That was uh, too much. In a worst case scenario, if I don't bonk him... I guess I could pr probably try to bonk him there. with the golden door. Oh, hell yeah. 
Get in there, Theo. Let's just restart chapter. We'll do the chapter one more time. Hopefully I can do it in one life. I can't believe I've gotten all the way to the end of this chapter and the end is where I'm having a bit of struggle with. It's going to be nice if I can get this golden. Doing two of the more annoying levels that people find is... Uh, uh, which is this one and... Uh, hotel it's uh it it's it's fun to know that i've done the probably harder ones on a side i got stuck restart chapter so if i die i'm just going to restart this chapter until i can do it consistently Don't try to jump on him. Now I'm just getting hasty. You know what? I need my fan on. It's fucking hot in here. Whew. I didn't even mean to bonk him there, but it is what it is. Bonk him there. See ya, buddy. Okay, this one, I just go here. Oh, no, not that. I guess I'm gonna get that when I go back for him. Oh, he bunked it in. That didn't work. No, okay, I gotta go up. Let me just practice this room a bit. This room is the only other room I have a bit of trouble with. Alright, pick it up. Nice. I gotta make sure to diagonal dash there. Okay. <gasps> oh, I was hoping it was gonna crush him. Okay. Him. Oh, well, that's a... Uh... <laughs> Just kill me. Didn't mean to jump. But that works, nonetheless. Well, what's the, uh... When you finish Resident Evil 4, are you planning on playing something else? And try and bonk him here. Yeah. Oh my god. Not the ideal plan, but okay. Yeah, Quell, well, when you finish Resi 4, are you planning on playing anything else? I, uh... I'm looking forward to the next games I'm going to be playing. As much as I'm going to miss Celeste, I, I do want to move on to other things. And I'll be playing this off stream. Okay, let's just do that. Okay, we can bonk him there. 
Uh, yeah, but I'm not sure what yet. Honestly, just look at your backlog and try to... Try to figure it out from there, you know? Oh god, you hit the thing. Nope, 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 nope. Bad, bad. Yeah, just look at your backlog. That's what I do. I look at what's on my backlog, what games I already own, and then go from there. Oh, I bonked him. I don't know how that works, but okay. Okay, I got a bounce there. Okay, I can bonk him there. <laughs> However, that worked. Thanks, man. Oh, that was too far. Go. Like, on a, uh, for me, streaming, my streaming right now is just... Is just catching up on all my games that I've just got lying around, you know? when you up there. Yeah, we can get through that pretty simply. How goes the quest for the golden berries? We are about to go get it for this one. I think we've got this final section down pat. Yeah, I didn't bonk him, but that's fine. I can bonk him over here. Okay. Yeah, other than two of those rooms, uh, we should be pretty good. Pretty good to go. Yeah, that's generally what I do. I haven't put any thought into it yet. What I like to do is I like to look at every game I have. I, it's easy. It's easier for me because I can see them on my shelf over there. But like I look at every game I have and I and I like kind of rank them in which one I'm looking more forward to playing than any other. And uh, you know if I if I had to pick just one that I would love to play or three even uh, then I would go with that one. So I find the one I want and then go with it. Although it's been a bit easier recently because Hollow Knight and Celeste were more or less suggestions slash challenges from uh, Roldar and Sortex. But um, the next few games I'm moving on to are going to be really fun. Especially the secret one I have coming up. That's going to be hella good. I can't wait to play it, honestly. <laughs> I'm hyping the fuck up out of it because it's it's just so good. It looks so cool. Rodar, do you know what game you're playing next? I think I've already asked this, but I'll ask again because, you know, I, um, I am interested in, uh, what you're playing. Part of me is think always thinking, I hope you play something I just have no interest in playing so I can actually watch, like, properly and full. Or something I've already played. Like the first, uh, Plague Tale. But, you know, it is what it is. After Stanley? Yeah, after Stanley. I don't think Stanley's going to take you, like... Like, that's why I call certain games that I play big games and small games, because, like, Celeste, or Hollow Knight at the very least, you know, was a big game. It took me 100 hours to do everything. <gasps> I'm dead. It took me 100 hours to do everything I wanted to do in it. I wasn't paying attention. It's like, when I think of a big game, I think of, like, uh, you know, 100 hours plus. What the hell? 
It doesn't have to be 100 hours, but like, if it's around that mark, oh, I missed it. If it's around 50 plus hours, I would say that's a big game, you know? Going to squeeze another stream out of Stanley Parable, uh, be done with it. I see, I see. I think there's something like 30 endings. Are you going to try and get all the endings, or are you going to just... Uh, where do you feel comfortable leaving it, you will leave it? You know what I'm really looking forward to tomorrow? Sons of the Forest. <laughs> I'm really looking forward to that. I need to write something in my Discord about it. I completely forgot. I was surprised when I saw you didn't have the... Uh, when you didn't have the Ultra Deluxe version of uh, Stanley Parable. I thought you would have gotten that one because it was like the newer one. I'm dead. Oh, I could have saved that. Oh, yeah, I, I was, wasn't paying attention. <laughs> I asked the question and I looked at chat as I jumped across. Stupid deaths until we get the good one, you know? Oh, not that. Now that. But it's fine. It's fine. Stanley Parable, I I think I'm surprised that not more games didn't like try to copy Stanley's approach to uh, narrative. There were a couple, like, I remember this one called There Is No Game Here. And it was kind of a similar premise to Stanley Parable where the narrator was like more or less controlling everything. But um, yeah, I am somewhat surprised that there wasn't much more copies of, like, Stanley Parable's humor, at the very least. Alrighty, we're past the halfway point. Well, actually, I think the halfway point is actually when we get to the next big room. I think this room here is the halfway point. This time, don't die to the stupid. I know the timing of these. I don't know why I died to it. There we go. Now we're past the halfway point. Making good progress. Oh, I don't have a dash. Hey, my guy. How you doing? Welcome in. How's you doing? Taking care of yourself, my guy. Not the best, really. What's what's up? I skip this. Okay. You okay? Did something happen? Oh, I almost got crushed.
Are you, uh, are you doing alright, dude? met a really evil person a week ago and they are doing some really bad things it's too much to talk about but i've never met someone this evil if you uh define evil you don't have to tell me what happened but define like evil That does sound rough, for sure. My, I guess the best advice I can give you is just don't talk to them. Stop talking to them and then, you know. this way. Poor. Okay, we passed that. If you want to talk about it one-on-one, uh, -on -one, hit me up on Discord. Yeah. Profoundly immoral and wicked. That's the definition of evil, but like... Like, uh... Are they doing something directly to you? Are they, are they like saying, are they doing things behind your back? Are they like, what do you mean by evil? That's what I mean. Oh, I gave myself a haircut. I'm a Karada. I'm just blown away by this person. Oh, there are people out there that are more, more, uh, I mean, if they don't even hide it, then, like, it's to be expected. My best advice to you is just to stop talking to them. Or, at the very least, have some form of evidence of their- of what they're doing, and then if they ever try to say anything against you, you could just point out the fact that they're abhorrently terrible. I don't think there's anything wrong with that. I will be right back. I don't want to do towards the end of this level while I need to go to the toilet. So I'm going to run to the toilet and I'll be right back. I'm getting them fired. Then if they try to attack me again, I'm letting the police know everything. I don't know the details, so just outrightly saying you're going to get someone fired does sound bad. I'll take your word for it, but like, just know that when you go down that route, you're probably... You're probably going to be more fire than what you think you will be. Especially if you're going to make them lose their job, so... My best advice to you is just ignore them and just... Maybe not try to make them lose their job, and just move on. It's probably the best advice I can give you. Otherwise, I'll be right back.
you work with them. I'll explain in person, but they're, they're evil, trust me, it's bad. I work with them sometime, I'll explain on stream. Sure, sure. But not anytime soon. Yeah, that's fine, you don't have to... You don't have to talk about it immediately. chapter. Alright, will he reset? That's the question. He will. Okay. 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 Alright, we're at the final stretch. I would just suggest uh, talking to your boss, letting him know what happened, and uh, more or less letting your boss sort it out, if anything. Yeah, workplace issues are always difficult. Okay. I did, they're dealing with it. Yeah, good, good. Climb. Come over here. There we go. Oh my god, I missed the grab, but I'm fine. It's okay. Dude. I'm up here. Yep. Okay, just take my time with this. Okay. 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 Not the last room, but... Oh! 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 stretch. Final room. Ooh. Let me bonk him. I didn't bonk him. Don't push me into those. <sighs> Wait for it.
Yes! <laughs> yes! Let's go! Golden Berry number... what's that? This is chapter 5, I think? Oh, man. Yes! Two attempts, realistically. Oh. Oh, I'm so happy. GG's, everyone. Oh, my God. Oh, man. That was so good. <sighs> oh, this is going to be fun. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, wait. I got to go. Okay. Oh, man. Well... Uh, it's my, it's just fascinating because I've met bad people, but I've never met anyone I can compare to a devil. I'm not sad about it. I'm just fascinated and frustrated. I'll tell you this much, uh, uh, my guy. That there's always going to be someone out there that's... That's the absolute worst there possibly could be. Wait, I want to practice something. How do I just stop on a wall when I have a feather? Okay, so I can just grab a wall like that. Okay. Cutscene. Now we're down here. Oh, this is where the golden berry is. Okay. Well, let's practice this. Did I, like, clear this whole room, and then... And then get that golden berry and go up? Oh, he doesn't come up. Okay. Cool. I'm done talking about me. How are you, my guy? I am... I'm doing all right. I I had a bit of a, a bad sleep last night, but I'm doing all right, more or less. Um, I would like to try and get my sleep down a bit better, but um, I am otherwise doing pretty good. Okay, so I need to... I gotta do that. Wait, do I even need to do that? Can I just skip that altogether? I can. Okay. Oh, there's spikes there. Whoops. Okay. Okay. Wait, can I make the dude just go through the... Oh, wait, no, I can't. Never mind. He highlighted the sloth. That's funny. Oh, okay. All right, so I gotta go this way. Up. Okay, I see. It's not too hard. This level's good because you don't really have to do too much. Wait, can I just climb the wall over here? Can I just like neutral jump off this? <laughs> I can. That time I gotta hold on to the side of it. Okay. I am doing very good myself. Considering I just got that golden berry, I'm very happy with myself. Yo, how you doing, Swift IRL? Okay, so I can just hold on and I'll be fine. Welcome in, welcome in. I am doing golden berries. I'm just looking at the route I need to take for this one. Oh, okay. I gotta... 
Got it, got it. Makes sense, makes sense. You, uh, you played, uh, Celeste before Swift? Oh, well, that. Okay. There we go. This room's more or less just a practice room of the, uh, bouncy pads. Right? Yeah. Don't even have to really do them. Wicked, I was super close to getting uh, the 7A Golden uh, and died on checkpoint 12. Ah, oh, really? Is that the... I, I forget exactly which uh, part that is, but is that the part where you got to go between, like, crystals? You got to go, like, left, up, right, up, left, up? You know what I mean? Is that that part? Because that's, like, the one part I feel like I would... I'm going to struggle the most on. Oh, yeah, there's multiple routes in this place, isn't there? This one's... I think I like going the bottom way. I think I went this way last time. Yeah, I did. I remember this. Oh! It's got a bubble around it. I didn't even see that. That's, uh, checkpoint nine. Ah, I see. Yeah, I like on the feather way. We just did, um... We just did, uh... Mirror Temple. And, uh... It was pretty fun. I, I did it more or less. I got most of the way on my first attempt, but I had to practice the ending. Um, to really... To really like uh, get down pat the route I wanted to take with the dude. Okay, I'm just gonna play it safe then. I <laughs> touched the head. You know what? What's the other direction like? I could probably get it, but I have mostly been playing Strawberry Jam. I saw a trailer for Strawberry Jam a little while ago. Oh, hell no. I'm not going this way. Fuck that. <laughs> this is the way to go. Uh, and it looked cool to me. However, I am a completionist and a completionist streamer. And I'm more or less only doing... There's not really much... Do this room. I'm more or less only doing... Uh, oh, this looks easy. What's the other one? Yeah. Uh, everything in the game and then moving on to my next. This is actually my final stream for this game, but I will be getting all of the golden... Um, all of the golden... Uh, strawberries at some point. Yeah, that's, that's so much easier than what I saw in that other room. down. Mm, that looks simple. What's down here? I could do this. Nah, I think I'll go the other way. You will not get 202 berries unless you put years and years into this game. That's not true. That's not true at all. Uh, the dude who one who did an entire playthrough deathless only took him uh, 1,500 hours to practice that. So that's not true at all. It won't take years. Solely because of Farewell. Farewell actually doesn't look that challenging, to be perfectly honest. It's just long. It's just a matter of 
Yeah, I knew I was gonna die there. It's just a matter of um, persistence. It's why you should practice every aspect of the level. Yeah, I just gotta go straight through. I can actually save myself here if I need to. Yeah, straight through. <laughs> it's, uh... It's kind of my specialty to persist through the absoluteness of games. It's what I do, it's how I play games. I guess I could just drop here, right? See why not. Yeah, okay. We can drop all the way down. I'm just going through this level right now just to remember it, more or less. And I, I saw this hole and I want to go down it. Save me some time. There is a hole there I could go down. Is there a way to easily get down that? Yeah. No, there isn't. No, that's not worth going down. Okay. This won't be the... The... Even if this is the hardest game I've ever had to 100%, it definitely won't be the first. Oh! Oh, there's spikes in the water. Okay. Stick left first. Okay. Just fall. Okay, get on top and jump. Okay, got it. Oh, just jump, don't move. Got it. Just a matter of practicing and learning the... Okay, I do kind of move. What the fuck? Run, big boy! And he stops quietly. Thank you. Oh, there she is. All right. Time to... Time to fight and battling. Let's take my time with it. Because as long as I... As long as I... Uh, take my time, she shouldn't hit me. Well, then that crushed me. Just gotta wait for the laser beams. Uh, they should add an achievement uh, for beating Dark Souls without taking damage. I could watch you play Dark Souls for years. I've... I don't know about taking damage, but no deaths? Maybe, sure. I've done that before. I find it fun. Oh, there's a bouncy pad there. Oh, I didn't even see that. Okay, I gotta pay attention to the ground. There's bouncy pads everywhere. Okay, I thought that was gonna hit me. Go. Well, again, I wish you luck on your endeavors for 114%. Is there a percentage in this game? I didn't know there was a percentage, but thank you. Thank you. I wish you luck on your endeavors as well. Uh, I hope you get the uh, the final berry uh, for 7A. Although there is 8 after that, but like, you know. There is a uh, chapter 8 after that, but... It, uh, it more or less... From what I've heard people say... Oh, okay, that was going over me anyway. Okay. Okay, I've just got to run for this one. Okay. It, uh, from what I've heard people say, Chapter 8 is easier.
Not really, but most people consider all goldens on top of 100% as 114%. So I would be at 103% maybe? Okay. How many does she shoot of those? Let me see. I want to see how many of uh, those shots she does per thing. I jumped into it. Okay. One, two, three, three. One, two, three. <laughs> run, bitch! Run! One, two, three. Alright, same thing here. Three. One, two, three. Okay. Whoa! <laughs> hey, my guy, thank you so much for the gifted sub. Oh, I bounced on the roof. Okay. Thank you so much, dude. Okay, go underneath and then hit her from below. Got it. <laughs> oh, that counted. Okay, I don't know how that didn't kill me, but okay. <laughs> oh, you get a Crazy Pie. Got it. Let's go. I know Crazy Pie really like that. Thank you so much, my guy, for the gifted sub. Honestly, it helps a lot. You don't have... Nobody has the sub. I have ads turned off for that very reason. But if you guys, you know, sub, then honestly, it really helps me out. It really does. Should have been swift. Uh, you can... You can, like, click their name and then gift them a sub. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. No probably. No problem. Don't worry. Thanks, man. I really do appreciate it. She's getting weaker before she gets stronger. Ah! My feather ran out at the wrong time. <laughs> An anonymous gifter. Hmm, wasn't me. Really, really, really. It wasn't you? Well, whoever it was. Oh, God. I wonder who. <laughs> you gifted yourself a sub. Okay, I think I'm dead here. Oh, my God. I swear, thank you for the follow. <laughs> <laughs> That's a bit backwards there, isn't it? The, the gifted sub before the follow. But... <laughs> I, I uh, again, I, I don't have ads on because I don't think there's any reason to have ads on at this time in my streaming. But, um... Oh. But, um... But if, uh... If people subscribe, you know, I, I do appreciate it because... It does help me out. Okay, I could just bounce over that. I do think I'm going to have to practice... Oh, shit. Practice this last bit a bit more. Oh, that was more distance than what I wanted. Although I could probably just cover that whole distance if I really wanted to. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, nearly went straight down to the spikes. I love this fight so much. Oh boy. Oh, and we're done. 
Wait, isn't there more after this though? I'm just trying to help you. Oh no, yeah, this is the super part. Oh no, it's not super, it's just a lot more going on. Okay. Ooh. He must have been the, the guy. <laughs> you don't want your three cents per string? Nah, I don't particularly care for three cents per... The hell killed me, I dashed. Okay, so the moment... Wait, can I walk? I don't particularly care for three cents per, per stream. Oh, I thought that was going to go up all the way. Well, she's either getting weaker or stronger. Come back here, battling. I just want your autograph. Let's not jump there. Oh god, I nearly died there. <laughs> I stepped away just the last second. Okay, cool. Good for me. Just do all the hoppity hops. That'll do the trick. There we go. This does go for quite a bit. I'm surprised it goes for this long. You know, funny enough, Seasides are the easiest golden berries to get since they're only three screens each. I know, right? When I did Seasides, I was like, there's no way it's actually three screens for every single one, right? Although, uh, seven and eight do look like they're gonna be... Yeah, I gotta remember to go straight to the right there, okay. Seven and eight do look like they're going to be a bit annoying. Like eight has that whole like every part of every single level in it section. You know what I mean? Jesus, I flew. Control my... Oh, fuck. I should've just gone straight for her. Surprisingly easy when you get the better movement. Yeah, now that I know a lot more of the techniques from uh, Farewell, uh, it's, uh, and... That was stupid of me. Now that I know a few better techniques, like, uh... Like, uh, how to do multiple versions of the, uh, the Hyper Dash, it's not gonna be that bad. Although, I do practice everything pretty... Pretty well before I do them. Oh god, oh okay, the crystals broke. Alright, so that's the end now, right? Yeah, that's that's not the end of the level, I don't think though. Level up. Yeah, it's all about taking the advanced movement and becoming neutral and second nature. Something I, I want to practice a bit more. It's not even necessarily for the golden berries, but like I want to practice the. I want to practice the neutral. The neutral. Uh, the neutral jumps. I could do it on the right side. I can't do it on the left side. I've never tried it on the left side, to be honest. Yeah. I want, I want to practice that more. I don't necessarily need it, but I do want to practice it. And since I'm going to be doing most of my uh, stuff off stream now, after this stream, it'll probably be something I just do then. So is this end just simply going up more with the double dash? More or less teaching the double dash in this? Everything becomes second nature eventually. Yeah. Do you use the joystick or do you use the D-pad when you play? Right, that's the end of the level, correct? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so I think I'm going to practice 
I think I'm going to run through the level one more time and figure out where I'm going to struggle the most. And then from there, I will... I will go from there. Yeah, uh... The, the goldens on most of these levels... The hardest one is definitely going to be Farewell. But otherwise, the rest have been... I haven't found too much difficulty in most of the levels. Uh... So far. You switch... Oh, you played this on Switch, I see. Yeah. And Farewell, there's, there's 800 more deaths there than what there should be. Because I went through, ha like, halfway through the level and then restarted. To do it all in one stream. Is it true that VTubers hide their face because they pick their nose? Yes. That is 100% true. Anyone who says otherwise is lying. Oh. Oh, that gives me back my dash anyway. play on PC, but use Switch controller since I played on Switch re in initially. Oh, I see, I see. See, I've, uh... Wait, can I skip this whole room? No, there's crystals there. Okay. I need a new controller. Uh, I've been thinking for a while that my controller's been a bit... Yeah, no, you can't bring him up here, so there's no point in even trying. My control, Like, when I try to do the that I can't do it properly every time when I go to the sorry when I go to the left it's hard for me to do it maybe it was just that level actually this uh this reverse dash hyper dash I can do it now easily what the hell but um yeah I could do it to the right here properly but when I was trying to do it to the left like this I couldn't get it yeah like that and I was practicing for a skip in uh, Mirror Temple. By the way, if there are any skips in this level, I, I'd love to hear them because I think... I don't think there is, but if there is, other than that one that I found earlier... Um, I don't even have to do this. I can skip this. Uh, uh, yeah, other than that one that I found earlier... Uh, it'd be nice to skip through it. How do I remember the level? This will be a lot easier. Okay, now I gotta jump at the top. Yep. I can skip this with a neutral wall climb. Okay, I won't skip that. There's no point. There's no there's no chance of me dying here, so fuck it, we'll just do it properly. When I first got here, I saw this feather and I was like, oh, where do I go from here? You just go to right. It's so stupid. I really don't like that. <laughs> it's so obvious, but so dumb. Uh, the only major skip is the neutral jumps uh, to skip the f a feather. Yeah, this one right here, right? Yeah. It's not, it's not even like I would die even if I... Even if I was to... Uh, go the normal route. The feather inside the block is for Crystal Heart. Yeah, I know. I've, I've got all the Crystal Heart. I have all the achievements in the game. I just... I just, uh... I'm going for the berries now. Okay. Well, I haven't died so far, which is a pretty good sign, I think. Uh, do I go up or down here? I forget. If I go up... Well, let's go up. I think this is the way I went last time. I think that uh, practicing a level and figuring out the route you want to take, especially in a level like this where uh, there's more nuance to the level than otherwise. Up or down? I think I went down here. Yeah, I did go down here, yeah.
I gotta remember when I come out of the feather, it kind of bumps me up just a little bit. I spent a majority of my time in Celeste speedrunning. Really? Rather than going for the Goldens? Actually, you know what? That's what baffled me about the, um... The... The one dude who's... The one and only dude who's been able to do all of uh, Celeste in one... A life. Was that... I thought the speedrunners by now would be able to do every level without... Like, dying. Oh. Well, there's my first death. This room here is probably going to be the hardest. In fact, I might even attempt the other one first. Let's try this room. Is this room actually easy and it just looks harder? Yeah, this room's easy. Okay. Can you not, please? I understand there's a pit down there, but like, if anyone died there, that'd just be sad. Yeah, that room's fine. Okay. Most speedrunners always go for fastest uh, strats. Uh, even when going for golden, so it takes a few deaths sometimes. Well, I mean, it's going to take a lot of deaths before you get used to the levels, right? Let me do the other room. I think I did this one last time. Uh, let me see what this room's like. So far, I've just been up every single time. Oh, no, this is the room I went for last time. Never mind. Yeah, this room's easy. Just too high. Okay. Okay, easy peasy. Alright, we're up to battling, which is pretty neat. Oh, Granny's here. He's got to do the long drop, and then we're up to battling, and uh, that's a... Let's not skip through this room. We'll do one, two, and then we won't. Okay. We just fall. But yeah, I was surprised when I heard that, like, a lot of the speedrunning community still... Oh, wait, yeah, that's my skip that I want to do. Ooh. I have, uh, I, I have seen more skips right there, like that hole there. And you can keep going down, but like, I don't think there's any point to it. I don't think there's any point to trying to skip more than what you need to. I'm in the water now, yep. Nice. Okay, now I gotta stick left. No need for me to try to speedrun this. Just drop. Straight down. Alright. Nearly up to battling. There we go. I remember an old speedrunner named uh, TH TGH used to do 200 berry runs before Farewell was released. What was the what was the name of the guy who um, who did all of Celeste in one uh, in one sitting. Oh god. Almost got crushed. Right, I want to wait for these things to come down before I go. Do you know the guy's name? Yeah, the Deathless guy. The guy who did all of Celeste, including Farewell, uh, without dying. Oh, I thought I died there. Oof. 
cool. I dashed. Okay. I, I can seemingly... I think I'm going to practice this part. The rest of the level is not too bad. Okay, yeah. I should just go straight for that wall. Oh, five? Oh, I thought it was only four. Okay. Five shots, man. That was not the direction I wanted to go. Damn it. Okay. <laughs> Fuck. Man, my D-pad. Do what I want you to do. Tried to boom me. I personally don't care much for golden berries. I mainly do any percent and modded stuff. You've done all of the, the D sides, correct? I don't think I'm going to do D sides. I'm getting better at this, that's for sure. Oh! <laughs> Immediately. Okay, good night, everyone, and have a good day, Devil. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate you being here. Thank you again for the gift of sub. And if it was you who gifted the anonymous sub to Swift, then thank you. I do appreciate it, honestly. These sides are a little too rough for me to grind out. I could probably do it, but prefer stuff like uh, st strawberry jam. Right. Wait, isn't strawberry jam harder than D sides though? I thought it was meant to be harder. That was the impression I got anyway. <gasps> oh fuck, I didn't see the crystals. Okay. I know, I'm not saying all of Strawberry Jam, I'm just saying that I heard that Strawberry Jam is like meant to be like, have some of the hardest levels made in it. Uh, Strawberry Jam has all difficulties. Yeah, yeah, I can't do Grand Mouse to stuff. Right, right. So is it, if you know, uh, if you know um, Geometry Dash, is it similar to that where like... Fuck, I knew it. I knew I was gonna die there. Is it similar to... Wait, can I... What happens if I just go past her? Well, that doesn't help. If I just keep hitting her. I don't think I can go past her. Huh? What the hell hit me? Oh, there's a thing there. I see. Okay, this is the... This isn't the end, but... After this, I think I will practice her a bit more. Oh god! I forgot they go right to the roof. Ooh. So what are the levels? 
Up. What are the levels? Is it just like a novice, adept, uh, master, grandmaster or something? Because I know that the- I, I know most of the time whenever there's like Master and Grandmaster, it's following the same, uh... It's following the same, uh, motif as like, uh, chess. The way chess categorizes their players. Cool, cool, Whoa, I like wasn't trying to hit her, my she just went straight for her. Fuck. Okay, I gotta go higher. Okay. All the little intricacies. Oh. And we're done. Yeah. Okay, so I think what I'm going to do is practice this end of part. Uh, I think it's beginner, intermediate, advanced, expert. Is there not master before grandmaster? I would have thought, so I can do that, that, that. Okay, so here is where I need to practice. Is it? No. I don't know why that's a chapter, it's like, it's just talking to her. Oh wait. Yeah, okay, let's, let's practice from here. I gotta do a bit of a fall here. Nope, mm, okay. Seems a bit weird that they wouldn't be master than grandmaster. One. Oh, I'm not gonna do the skips. Okay. Let's fall down. I love how thin she gets as you fall. <laughs> when you fall for long enough, you just see the thin... The thinness of the model. Nice, nice, nice. That in one life. Let's right, stick left. Right. And just fall straight down. Okay, yeah, we'll practice this. <gasps> oh, you're kidding me. Ah, oh, well. Let's go. I can do advanced just fine and some easier expert maps. So how many people can do like Grandmaster? Cause if, oh, this was where, okay, okay, I see. Okay, so yeah, that's where I've got it. <gasps> okay, note to self, don't, don't let her hit me like that. So how many people can do the Grandmaster ones? I would assume the people who can do them can do all the golden berries, right? Let all the blocks fall down. Let's take my time with it. Or is it like, the people who can do Grandmaster don't care to have gone and gotten all the golden berries? Because I know that like... You know, there's uh, there's some people who just don't do all the levels in, like, say, Geometry Dash. Uh, before they start doing Grandmaster up. <gasps> oh, God. God. Saved myself. Okay, nice, nice.
Okay. Uh, Monarch has D sides would probably be mid high expert. Also, the D sides that I've heard about are expert. Ooh, nice. Three, four, five. Bro, what? I'm looking. I don't know how I died there. I was holding right the entire time. Wait, I can just... Let me, let me try something. Yeah, I can. I didn't even think about that. I haven't even been thinking about my hyper dash throughout this entire endeavor. I can hyper dash him. Oh, I don't know why I didn't dash there. I've been playing for five years and Celeste is my favorite game and I've never beaten the easiest Grandmaster map in Spring Collab. Really? Rabbit, welcome in. You're talking about fan-made Celeste maps? Yeah, we are. I'm asking like what the range of, uh, what the range of difficulty is for the Grandmaster maps, you know, like would the people who have done Farewell Golden have <gasps> Oh, I don't know why I did that have uh... If they've done the if the people doing Grandmaster Have done uh, Farewell Goldenberry or if uh, Farewell Goldenberry is just harder purely by Persistence rather than like actual level design Yuck. How you doing, rabbit? Oh, that's, uh, that's definitely something. Oh, I can't see that pink thing there. My brain don't register it. How you doing, rabbit? You doing well? I think most grandmasters don't care much for the main game. Yeah, I mean, eh. to be perfectly honest, that's a that's a yikes take on the on the grandmasters side, if you ask me. I think if you if you are going to really hone your skills in an aspect of the game. I mean, caring caring and respecting something is two different things, I guess, but... I went straight into it. I, I don't know, there's... There's a level of uh, care you gotta have for a game like this, especially if you want to do, like, the, the modded stuff and the, you know, the Grandmaster modded stuff. I don't know, maybe that's just my take. <gasps> God, I nearly died. Part of the reason why I 100% games is because I want to 
experience and appreciate everything the devs had to put into the game for me to experience and play. Well, not just me, but everyone, really. But... What the hell? Ah, oh, I touched it. I forgot you can, like, slow down if you, uh... I think this room's gonna be the room I have the most trouble with. This is the last room, too, isn't it? Yeah, okay. I should... I should... I think I'm gonna have to practice this room a bit more than what I think. Fuck. I tried to dash through it. I mean, when you play Celeste a lot, you either play a lot of modded, speedrun, or are a completionist. I'm pretty sure Grandmasters are just people who got 114% and wanted more. Yeah, but like... I suppose I, I, I wouldn't mind having a discussion with a... Okay, I've got to slow down. Between... Not this one. Here. Yeah. I <laughs> touched it by the skin of my teeth. I'd love to have a discussion with the Grandmaster and really discuss with them what they think of the overall. Right? Go right? Right, please? Uh, what they think of the game overall. Okay. I think that's the play. Right there. Where I grab the feather right as she shoots. And that's the end. Okay. Uh, restart chap. No, back to map. I'll, I'll practice this one a bit more till I can get through here pretty well. I mean, you can't be that good and not like the game, right? Well, <laughs> some people are. Some people can be very good at things and just absolutely hate it. And I don't know why. It's not exactly a take I have, but... It's, uh, it's definitely up there. People, people can do plenty of, uh... Can really not like something and still play it. What I think about Call of Duty players, you know, they really, they really like, they, they like the game. But they really hate the game. They're pretty good at the game, but then some like twelve-year-old kid comes up and kicks their ass. So like, they're in a mixed field of I hate this game, but I love this game. But I hate this game, but I love this game. <laughs> I'm okay. I'm looking at Celeste uh, Grandmaster maps now. Ooh, nice, nice. Patiently continues waiting for Rabbit's noitier stream. Yeah, I know, right? When is it, Rabbit? Uh, these look tough. I wonder how they compare to Mario ROM hacks and if there's any overlap in the creators. Probably. There probably is some overlap. They like, uh, they like, like, moderate difficulty Kaizo Mario. Yeah, GM maps are ridiculous. Yeah, I, I don't think I'm going to be trying any of them. But I wouldn't, wouldn't mind, like, taking a look at one. Maybe on, uh, just on YouTube. Oh, okay, so I can't just drop down. Let me restart chapter. I want to try and do... Not not the whole chapter in one go. Uh, but, like, I, I want to try and get... The... Uh, I want to try and get the transition screens a bit better. So I'll just take my time at the start here. Time. Oh shit, I need to scratch my back. Ah. They look like... It's not, it's not exactly what they look like. I mean, like, what they... What you have to do to get past them. Okay, I could probably catch her. Before she does her first blast there. Oh, I thought I was going to die there. Okay. Alright, so three now. Oh, still just one. Oh, 
I like I got a haircut from that orb. Oh my god. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, not bad, not bad. Should have just gone straight back. Ah, oh, so annoying. Da, da, brr, what? Dash. Thank you. <laughs> Fuck. I should bait it. Sunken all, oh, welcome in. How you doing? How have you been, Hunter? I've been through the wrecker. My health has been all over the place, and my uh, my stream has been all over the place, and and uh, it's it's been it's been a bit of a bumpy ride recently. But you know, I'm getting through. But how are you, Sunken all? I haven't I haven't seen one of your streams recently. I was uh. Getting a little bit concerned for you. Cool. Financial struggles? Yeah, I have like fifteen dollars in my name right now. <laughs> Feels, man. Feels. I'm just gonna wait. Dude, okay, don't hold forward. Okay, that, that little point there is a bit annoying. Okay. Got that down. Give me one second, Sunken Ore, and I'll be back with you in just a second. Okay, there's a thing here. Okay. I definitely ain't a speedrunner, and I'm glad that there's no speedrunning uh, trophies in this game. Oh my god, the, the Hollow Knight one was enough. I, I, although I suppose it doesn't help, I did my speedrun with Steel Soul, so... <laughs> I like that Badlin looks like an upside-down star when she, like, zooms across the map. Did anyone ever notice that? <clears throat> the easiest Grandmaster map in Spring Collab, you have to chain together six Ultra Dashes and carry all of the speed. Through the entire level. Fuck that, man. That sounds like pain. Okay, this, this room's pretty easy now. But I know what the hell I'm doing. Oh, I didn't have my dash. Oh, damn. I was hoping I could do that. I want to try and use my, um, my actual ability, uh, endgame abilities in this part. Oh, boy, I almost died there. This room is the hardest room. <gasps> no! <laughs> okay, I gotta be careful of that. I thought I was safe, but I wasn't. Okay, I gotta be careful there as well. <laughs> Full-time college vibes. Yeah, man. I never went to college, though I might be soon. 
I got new mouse at the Goodwill for like six bucks. It looked like uh, a gamer mouse and it, cur <laughs> and it curves uh, to the natural hand. Ah, oh, so you got one of the ones... A lot of mice are being made like that these days. I've, I've come to realize that... Uh... Oh shit, I didn't mean to... Well, that kind of works. That didn't work. That didn't kind of work. Ah, shit. Okay, I took too long. I got a noon mouse for my birthday the other day. I, um, I really like it. It works really well for what I want. Okay, that's what I wanted. Okay, yeah. And that's the final room. Let's try that again. I think we're gonna have to practice this a good few times before we really get it down pat, you know, ready for Goldenberry. But, um... Let's see if I can't just, uh... Do it, like... Let's see if I can't just get through it rather... Oh, that worked. Ooh. Full speed ahead, baby. <gasps> oh, that's... <laughs> I can't go full speed that way. Okay. Okay, that works. That works. Two, three, four, five. Let's go, chase it down. Nope, can't do that, okay. Oh no, who got timed out? Sunk and all, ah, ah, why? I swear to God, every time. Where are you? Oh, you, you... Okay, you got timed out, then you left. Okay. <laughs> God damn it, Or. At least you're not showing up in my list here. Uh... Well. <laughs> the easiest to remember, uh, 7 Ultra Dashes. Severe penalty for posting a link. Any mods in chat? No, I... I've only got two mods, and honestly, I don't feel like I need mods yet. What do I need mods for? Like, seven people? <gasps> Can't do that. For, like, seven people? It's like... Ooh. Oh! I worked out. You know, like... I don't get the point of having mods, except for, like, the occasional, like, big stream, you know, you're gonna do. Like, I did a drunk Sekiro stream, where I played through the whole game on my fourth... New game, plus, and that was the only time I needed mods. And I've only got mods because of that, otherwise I wouldn't even have mods myself. Okay. I just watched a video of the heart side for Grandmaster Spring collab and some of it is almost incomprehensible. Really? I can only imagine that the Grandmaster ones takes full advantage of every single um every single uh technique that is in the game. <gasps> oh, I thought I made it. Okay. Well, this is going to be a Okay, I need to make sure I have my dash there. Much like there. Okay, you know, I might just do that. I want to try and get through this relatively speedy, but if I can do it speedy, I can do it, you know, hitless as well. Okay. 
Okay, now we're gonna do the... Oh god, not that. <laughs> not like that, that's for sure. There we go. Yeah, this. What? Fast. Every time. I don't have enough speed. Well, when Sunken All comes back, we uh we need to make sure he remembers. He's done it a few times. <laughs> um <laughs> where he's uh posted uh links in chat <laughs> so I, I more or less think he he left more out of embarrassment than anything but it's fine ah! fuck i tried to go backwards to avert it but it didn't work okay you can't do that Oh, it's not gonna all you back. Welcome back. <laughs> I didn't leave. I went to go untime you out. You weren't there. You've done it a few times, you know. <laughs> Where you've posted links. Oh, I thought I jumped. I sat here in full five minutes. Uh, I see. I see. Well, don't do it again. <laughs> you caught the bonk. Okay, I'm just gonna... I don't know why I'm even trying to do this section speedy when she's not even like really trying to kill me that hard. Oh, I'll, I'll forget next stream. It's fine. Ah, <laughs> oh, I touched her hair. Didn't count. <gasps> That's not diagonal. Yeah, I'm. I'm. Fairly convinced, if not for the fact that, you know, my control is like <laughs> five years old, that I need a new controller. This is the last room, right? Yeah, it is. Oh, I almost got killed by the things there. Alright, there we go. Last room done. Is there anything back here? Like, at all? Can we even go back here? No, we can't. Alright, let's practice this one more time, then I think we'll go for the, the golden. I literally bought an Xbox 360 controller for less than $10 and use it to play a gamepad on my PC. See, I'm using my PS4 controller. I actually prefer the PS4 controllers. I like where the D-pad is. Um, because when I do 2D platformers like this, it's, uh, it's nice to have my, my thumb in the more convenient spot. I didn't get my dash back. Okay. All right. That works. Um... Oh, he didn't jump, bastard. Okay, well. God, there's so many things falling down everywhere. Okay, this one I'm going to. That. Go. One, two, three. I jumped too early. So what's the goal here? I am practicing this section of this level because I need to do this whole level deathless. That's what the golden berries are. Grabbed it. So I'm more or less just practicing the uh, this harder section, so that I can do the uh, the whole run in one go. Oh, 
probably doesn't help when I'm trying to be speedy about it, you know? Speedy Gonzalez. So I can get through that section without actually dashing. Okay. I am kind of just focusing on this for a second. I'll be back to chat in just a second. I do see messages, especially ones with my name highlighted on them. Ooh. Okay, this one we got a bit of respite. Don't try to rush this section. There's no need to rush it. No need to rush it. I mean, get my dash back. Yeah, I gotta do that on the when I drop down. I can't do it if I die. Okay, that's fine. I jumped into it. Okay, I'm gonna I'll reach out now. I have thousands of hours in Celeste and I'll still probably never be a Grandmaster level. Do you think that, um, do you think, how long do you think it would take to, to really get to Grandmaster? Or do you think, oh, what am I doing? I can't do that. Do you think that it's, um, do you think that it's, uh, something you can really grind out? Or do you think people have to have a more natural talent for it? That's an interesting question right there. Uh, yeah, you have, but you are a D-pad user. I like my sticks. For 2D platformers, uh, D-pad is, works better. Also, Hunter, I DM'd you a link, uh, the link instead. Okay, okay, I'll take a look at it, uh, after stream. Uh, after looking that up, the word that describes me. That's a word that describes me. Uh, what word? What does the word mean? Oh my god, I bounced higher than what I thought I was going to. Oh, that was lucky. Okay. Nice. Oh god, I almost fucked that up. <gasps> no, that was the wrong dash. Ah. Okay, I gotta remember to go left there. Hey, there we go. We did that room in one go. Okay, I think I think we're ready for uh, for Goldenberry. We practiced that quite a bit. Probably get to Grandmaster if I wanted to do nothing else, but there are no other things I would like to do, Lamel. I could probably get to Grandmaster if I wanted to do nothing else, but there are other th oh other things I want to do. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's fair. Um, is this technically where the golden strawberry is? It is. Okay. Cool, cool. If I can skip that first part, that's convenient. Alright, time to, time to officially start the golden berry. 
What other games do you like to play, uh, Swift? I know Celeste, you said, is your favorite game, but is there any others you like to go for? I go for a wide variety of genres, but I, I haven't played every single genre, like Grand Strategy or Fighters, like uh, Tekken and that. I haven't really played before. You know the guy who 100% is Deathless? Uh, I don't know the guy. I've heard of the guy, yeah. I officially peaked one gold one in Overwatch. Rec hey, nice, uh, Sunken Ore. Very, very, very nice. How long did that take you? And what, uh, what class were you playing? Tank, uh, healer, or DPS? Immediately dies. <laughs> I can't believe I died there of all places. <laughs> Just went the wrong direction. Oh, oh, I tried to get it on my way. I have an issue where I can't always see the, the feather. Oh god. I thought he was coming for me. Dude. Speedy Gonzalez not working right now. There we go. There we go. His name is Rick Fernoli, uh, Fernello, Rick Fernello, and he is a Grandmaster. Support all the way. Nice. Very nice. I'm G3 right now, support and bronze, uh, DPS. Tank gives me anxiety. I like playing tank in Final Fantasy XIV. Uh, I like, I I'd rather be the one taking all the damage in most instances whenever I play a game. Um, but um, I can I can see... Uh, but in uh, Overwatch, I, I actually rather playing Hanzo. I never really liked playing anyone else but him. It was uh, kind of weird, you know. Huh? I think press left. Okay. Again, I, I do need a new controller. It's not helping. But we are going to do it nonetheless. Let's see how far we can get. Outside of this starting area. <laughs> Dude, do the hyper dash, please. There's something wrong with my left. I don't know what it is, but it, there's something wrong with it. Oh god, I didn't get there. I'm doing terribly. I can't believe this. <laughs> the fuck is wrong with me? I love the bonk sound it makes. I probably should use my uh, my analog stick for the feathers. Probably the only time I should use my analog stick in this game. There we go. Hyper dashing to the left just isn't working for me. Maybe it's because I don't do it often. Unless my controller issues. Who knows? Go. Other games I play mainly uh, Osu. I don't know what Osu is. Uh, Track Mania. I don't know what that is. I know what Rocket League is and Genji Impact. I don't know what that is. When I'm really bored. Over practice the hard part. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> exactly. Oh, I missed it. Osu is a rhythm game. Oh, you know what? That's what Syllabus plays. Yeah, 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 yeah. But the other games I play mainly... Oh, well, yeah, that was you, Swift, who said that, not uh, something else. Uh, I like to be the one that heals all the damage. Yeah, yeah. 
Have either of you touched Hogwarts Legacy? I want to play Hogwarts Legacy, but I, I haven't bought it yet. I'm looking forward to playing it. I never read the books, but I liked the movies when I was younger. Except for the third one. I don't know why. The third one stuck out to me that I didn't really like it. Maybe it's because I'd already known what werewolves were. Um, and so that was like the gimmick of that one. Well, the, there was time travel. But the gimmick of that one was like werewolves. And I don't know. I just didn't connect with it. You didn't read the books? No, I didn't. <laughs> I did not. How dare I, right? <laughs> Also, what movie was that one? Uh, the Prisoner of Azkaban. That's the one that was. I've never seen the movies nor read the books. Yeah, there you go. Okay, so I think I'm mostly just staying upwards. Although, I think we are going to be watching the movies for movie night uh, sometime soon. Are you winning, son? I won one. I won. I did one golden berry. I'm doing my second one now. And if I can do this one, I'm down to just stream until I get the one on the summit. Although that's probably less healthy for me than what it sounds like. I think I go up here, right? This is one of the... No, I go down here. Yeah, I go down here, yep. How you doing, Marine? What are you up to? I'll break this one, can I? No. Uh, this one I think I go up? Yeah, I go up here. There we go. God. Oh, man. If I died there, I'd be so unhappy. <laughs> I died to the dumb spot. My parents make fun of me for saying tournament uh, instead of tournament. What? You're meant to say tournament. It's not tournament. Shit. I looked away for half a second. I'm American and Southern. Eh. Eh. That sounds the same to me. Marine is Southern, confirmed. it's gonna I think maybe there will be some parts I need to practice getting to the hard part but other than that I th should be fine with this one after fighting Madeline I mean oh, well. there we go Madeline not Madeline oh Take it easy, Swift. Thanks for popping in. I hope you uh, have a good night. It is uh, probably late there if you're in America. Definitely take care of yourself. And uh, yeah, I uh, this is my last Celeste stream. So if you just came for Celeste, then, you know, it's all good. But, you know, if I see you again, I'd love to talk more video game with you. This level is definitely, like, up there. I think Mirror Temple was actually a lot easier than, like, most of the other levels, to be completely honest. I don't know. It just seems that way. Oh, God damn it. The one time I start slouching, like, down a bit, I get post checked. Welcome back, Crazy Pie. And if you take a look, you are now subbed. 
thanks to a gentleman who goes by the name of my guy. How you doing? Uh, it's down. Yeah. Down. Go. Oh, oh. Damn, what a guy. <laughs> He's your guy. How do I thank the guy? Because... Thanks, mysterious guy. <laughs> um, I guess next time you see him in chat or you can maybe send him a whisper. I mean, I don't know the exact specifics of exactly thanking people, but, you know, I know he went to bed, so. Oh, sh shoot. I almost died there. Nope, 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 nope. Go. Easy peasy. Is it up there, go? I think it's up. I think it's this way. What's the other way? Yeah, yeah, it's up. Okay. So it's down, up, up. How are you doing, Crazy Pie? Did you, uh,. You dipped out for a little while there. You doing all right? Having a good day? Oh, the doorbell. <laughs> I love the doorbell. Dude, it's so good. This looks easy as fuck, no cap. Marine, you would have died about 2,000 times on the first level. Cool. No cap. <laughs> Okay, time to thread the needle here. Doing all good. How are you doing? I'm doing better. The more I've been playing this, the more better I'm feeling. Like, uh, how, like, I woke up pretty groggy, you know? And I started streaming. Fuck. Uh, I probably could have saved that, but I went the wrong way. I, uh, I woke up pretty groggy and, uh, because I, I didn't sleep well. I slept for, like, 10 plus hours. So I, um,. I, uh, I think it was 11 hours I slept for. So I'm not, not the most thrilled about it. And, uh, you know, it is what it is. I'm, uh, I'm not the healthiest I could be right now, uh, Crazy Pie. I, um, for the last 12 months been a bit unwell. I've had some issues that I honestly don't even know what is wrong with me yet. But when I do, it's... I talk about it on my stream because, you know, I, um... Oops. For the most part, I, I like talking about it because it, it gives me some form of comfort at the very least. Letting people know that, like, I'm not doing the best these days. Um... And it's... it's... I, I've grown up my whole life without any form of support, so... You know, just having some support, even in my own stream, in my own streams, is uh, is enough for me. You know, I saved the fuck out of that. <laughs> Shit, I didn't save that. <laughs> I looked away. Golden Berry challenge. Yeah, I'm doing Golden Berry while I'm not like at full mental, physical health. <laughs> Sunken Ore, when are you going to be doing Golden Berries? Golden Berry stream when? <laughs> Whenever you buy me the game. Dude, I'm not even working. What do you mean I buy you the game? Dude, I dropped so hard. Oh my god. I wasn't expecting that fast of a drop.
Well, I am not going to buy a game I don't enjoy. True, true. You don't like platformers, Sunken All? I love me a good platformer. 2D or 3D. I don't mind dying close to the start here and also the music in this level is really nice See, I dropped so fast before you meant to like kind of like stand for a moment There are a lot of games uh, that I file under the wood watch category and even fewer to put in the wood plate Yeah, that's fair. I I don't like Battle Royales, but I don't mind watching Battle Royales, you know? Um, as an atheist, I will repeat uh, what Grand Grand said. I'll pray for you. <laughs> okay. That's funny. I'm not going to lie. That's funny. Um... I'll send you good wishes. Thank you, Crazy Pike. Thank you, thank you. 13 hours. I slept for 13 hours today. You slept for 13 hours? Dude. Are you okay? I'm on well, but are you okay? Oh, I forgot about that. Alright, let's not die here again. So I think we're up to the next chapter. Or about to hit it. Nice, nice. Yeah, I think we're just about at the next chapter. I didn't touch it, damn it. Tried to touch it. Hey, Crazy Pie, have you thought about playing this game after seeing it uh, yesterday? When I, when I showed you it. Oh god, I thought I was going to die. I didn't have my hair. Uh, so it's down, up, up. Okay, so first one's down here. Cool. Oh. Are you ready for the halfway trauma dump uh, about my body likes to sleep in? Your body might like to sleep in, but is it because of any kind of condition? Like, are you, are you physically okay? Like, typically? Oh, that was... The wrong move right there. Jesus Christ, oh my god. Go up, please. Okay. I uh, I like to watch a bunch of games that like I know I probably would never play. Why I like having so many streamer friends and just other streamers I like to watch is if they're playing it, then that means I can get the experience without ever having to. Oh fuck! I thought I died. Oh, there was that little gap. I wasn't paying attention. That little gap. <laughs> uh, without having to play it myself. It's like the whole point of streaming, right? Thought about giving it a shot, but I want to play some games uh, that I've bought, but haven't had the chance to, because... Liege. Because life. Right, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, life be like that, eh? Cool. I could probably skip that crystal, but I'd rather just play it safe. There's some parts I'm playing it safe, and some that I'm just really not. Oh god. I... Touched it with the skin of my teeth. Oh my god. Okay. The next game... I I've got quite the lineup of games to get through, but I'm, I'm progressing through them pretty well, I think. Go. All right, we're up to the part that I've been practicing. 
So basically I spent years 11 to 18 with an awful with awful parents who were emotionally and mentally abusive occasionally even physically it was an escape for me so and so that became my coping mechanism I would sleep upwards uh, upwards of 16 hours on the weekends and go to bed at 8 or 9 p.m. and wake up at noonish the next day uh, it was the only time I felt safe, and so therefore it was easy for me. Yeah, I get that. I get that a lot. I understand. It's it's one of those times in your life where there's no real easy answer out. Don't fuck this up, Hunter. Yeah, I'll try. Pointer? What the fuck is Pointer? Bro. I knew you were 15, but I didn't know you spelt like a 15 year old. Actually, I'm gonna go down there. I can land here. Oh my god. Okay. Let's not do that. <sighs> yeah, no, I, I understand something. Or it. it I, I think as you go into your adulthood that it might be worthwhile trying to get out of the habit of sleeping for that prolonged period of time, but you know, definitely do what you need to do first, yeah? No, no, no. No, really. Existential bread! How's you... Oh god, I thought I didn't have the gold berry. How you doing, man? Welcome in! Player Jacob, welcome in. Let me give you a shout out, Bread. I love watching Bread's clips. I hope it's the one where... Yes! 7-Eleven, what did you put in it? <laughs> Soul Tyrant spazzing the hell out. Right, so do we just quit out? I can't. He's, he's twerking, he's twerking on stream. <laughs> <laughs> Get raided Australia, twerk master, yeah! But I've never seen this. <laughs> How was your stream, Bread? What were you playing? I don't have all the- I don't have the thing to tell me what you're playing, but... What were you playing? Dark Souls 1? Ooh, nice, nice. Red just got owned by skeletons. Oh, are you going for, uh, for Nito? Ah. With the butter knife, I see. The butter knife stream. Okay, we did it. Perfect. Thank you, big man. Thank you for taking me across the gap. Look at that background, man. That looks so sick. That's so cool. Hunter, you missed my message. Did I? Uh, I guess the freedom makes me sleep for about four hours or less on weekdays. I see, I see. Yeah, I'm 20. I almost forgot 15 years old existed on the internet. Yeah. It, uh, it be like that, Sunk Nor. It, uh, it's definitely... I, I do hope you can recover th uh, through time, but for sure, like, work on it and never give up on it, yeah? Because... Sleep, sleeping that long really takes out what time you can spend doing things in the day and you know it's it's better when you can get as much out of a day as possible you know it's divine butter knife now Ooh, right it's ready for a nito i see i see yeah dude i have not seen this area it is nice the, i'm doing the golden berry if i die i have to go back to the start of the level the internet needs an age restriction <laughs> it'll change my mind Okay, I've been practicing the hell out of this. So hopefully I don't die. I'm just going to take my time. Taking my time. I can probably get through here without taking my time, but I'm just going to take my time. Taking my time. I got one golden berry. I got a uh, mirror temple before this thread. Uh, but I am... If I could get this, I'm going to be so happy. Ooh, anyway, it's time to drink a monster. A monster energy drink? Really? I, I wonder why you're not sleeping. Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay. I If I miss many messages, just know it's because of this. 
I missed. Okay. Oh, I saw the ball and I was like, wait, ball? And then I didn't dash into it. Oh, that's so ill. <laughs> 13 hours is a long time. So, and so therefore I do the... I do the mouth and it's two days worth with one extra. Wait, what? Not sleeping tonight because I slept for two days worth. You know, sleep doesn't work that way. Sleep really does not work that way. Oh, well, well, the sheer fact that we got to her means that uh, I, die I didn't die to her. That's the primary part right there. That's the primary thing we need to take away from that run. Every run is a is an attempt, is a failure until we win. And there ain't nothing wrong with that. ADHD is a gift. Oh, I missed it. Uh, it's more of a more. It's less ADHD for some or Maybe yes, some ADHD. I don't know. I've never asked. But like, it's more of a traumatic experience for him that he sleep he sleeps for long periods of time. But sleep doesn't work that way. Doesn't matter how long you're awake for. Uh, sorry. It doesn't matter how long you've uh, slept for previously. Your body doesn't function that way. There's no stacking time slept. I haven't had it. I had ADHD when I was a child. Doesn't just go away. ADHD can go away as you grow older. I had it when I was a child. I no longer have it. Some people have it throughout their whole lives and sometimes it, it leaves people. It just depends on the person. You can get rid of ADHD. It's not really getting rid of it. It's more just how you developed growing up. I would almost say that, you know, with a rough childhood, you're probably less likely to to lose it as you grow older. I think I lost mine when I was about 21. Oh shit, I missed it. Oh god. Okay, well, I guess we're doing this the normal way. go down many children perhaps as many as half will outgrow their symptoms but there but others do not so ADHD can affect a person into adulthood Harvard University yeah there you go mine got worse once I left home I th I think yours might have gotten worse when you left home less because you became an adult but it and this was actually similar to me but actually more because you could actually just be yourself and I'm not saying this in a bad way, but just be a child, you know, you could you could do whatever you wanted and That's more or less what children try to do as they grow up, you know I'm Not calling you a child or saying that you uh, anything like that But like it is something I went through is when I like growing up I was never allowed to have like soft drinks or anything So when I started working the first thing I did was go buy a fucking shit ton of soft drinks I think that the inner child in us just comes out when we can finally be free of our parents. For real, for real. Probably let myself uh, stim and acknowledge it when I was able to put down the mask. Yeah, exactly. Okay, safe there. Okay, it's up. I had test anxiety. Test anxiety? What's test anxiety? Like, I don't need medication for it anymore. Uh, wait, 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 wait. I missed a bit. Uh, more tone downed. My dad as a kid was only able to have like one slice of bacon for breakfast. So for my breakfast, for me as a kid, he'd make 
a shit ton. Yeah. Sometimes the things we couldn't get, we just give to our kids or we just do for ourselves eventually. You know? And it's not that there's anything wrong with that. It's just that it can sometimes get a bit out of hand. So you should always take into consideration the fact that, you know, like... Just because you are free now doesn't mean you're free to do... You're free of consequence of any things you want to do, you know? Always take care of yourself. And don't try to do things that would otherwise be just outrightly wrong. Alright, we're back to the part. So we can get to the final part pretty consistently. It's just a matter of maybe practicing some more. And you know what? I may, I may in fact just run to the loo quickly. Because if I'm going to do this, I don't want to have to go to the toilet. I'll be right back. Okay, let's see how we go. <clears throat> Let me catch up on chat, then I'll go for it. Test anxiety is anxious in slash around test. Oh, I see. Right, right, right. Uh, my parents would eat it in front of me. Wait, eat what in front of you? front of me forcing me to eat flour bread and gravy don't most have people have test anxiety i think most people do once i well until you get reached the point where you just don't give a fuck whether or not you you pass the test um damn where's the protein i i mean the love great i love gravy but what the fuck uh dang it kind of wanted to see hunter pee himself during the boss fuck off marine stupid fuck uh watery gravy uh flour bread that was it that's kind of messed up, man. Kind of more severe than others, Marine. Uh, reminds me of uh, cookouts when they'd eat in front of us. I was always terrible with tests, but I don't really anxious about them. Medication myself with ADHD meds, uh, and yet tests still get me. Sankum, we need to take you to some KBBQ. Marine loves his KBBQ. Hey, if it's Marine, shout. I'll go KBBQ. Let's go. Marine's got more money than all of us combined, probably. Let's go. <laughs> and I would stress out uh, really bad over questions I didn't even know they freeze up. I feel like giving all of you the biggest of hugs ever. Yeah. Yeah. I, I'm kind of struggling myself, but like I'm I'm dealing with it in my own fashion. I only let people know about it so that they don't, they don't worry too much about me. Although I guess talking about it worries people, but it's better that it comes straight from my mouth rather than like hearsay, you know, with my own conditions. Which is why I am glad that Sunken All can open up about it and let us know himself. Same as player Jacob. When I learned to use uh, the test to my advantage, I got better at test taking. Hmm. I have $15 to my name. Literally one meal a uh, <laughs> day it. Damn, I'm spending $25 on Wendy's right now. <laughs> you fucking asshole. Okay. Surprised we can't catch this guy.
Okay. Nice, nice. Very nice. Right, this part's probably not the hardest, but just the part that would get me if I'm going to die anywhere there. Okay. Right, I think we're up to it. No, not yet. We've got to do this part, then we're up to it. I hate talk about myself, Lamau. I don't like to talk about myself or my past much, but I'd rather hear about others. Yeah, I always hated it and still hate talking about myself. Well, here's the thing, right? It is very therapeutic, fuck, to talk about yourself in the confidence of, uh, of friends. Because us as social creatures, you know, if we bottle up all of the things that we have going on inside of ourselves, we just explode at some point and we wonder why nobody wants to care about us and and all that. So talking about your issues is never a bad thing. Um, I do think that everyone should usually emphasize whether or not they want actual help for it or if they just want to talk about it. Because there's, there's two different types... Why do you drop so fast? Like, why? There's two different types of... Uh, talking about issues, right? It's, I want help with this thing, or I just want to talk about this thing, and, and if I, because when we say things out loud, we can let them go, or get through those problems a lot easier, simply by talking about them out loud to someone else, and having someone actually truly listen to them. So I think, I think that uh, talking about your issues is perfectly fine, and there's always a, Oh, if I had a fallen there again and died, I would have been so annoyed. I think there is a line, right? Sometimes there's some issues that are just better left not talking about. Very, very big ones, you know, trauma cases. You know, that's that's fine. Um, but I think just generally talking about our issues is perfectly fine. You know, it helps us get through them and maybe find some solutions to get through them from other points of views, and maybe other experiences similar to our issues. Should've ordered some nuggies. <laughs> I love how uh, wavy your character looks when you're in the water. Yeah, it looks cool, eh? Bro, I spent $20 on 40-piece nuggets, fries, and a drink the other day. Damn, I should have ordered some nuggies. I don't know how I eat it all. Damn. I, ever since I got sick, I've lost a lot of my appetite, and my appetite was, like, my favorite thing. I love eating food, but, like, just not being able to eat food just sucks, man. Part of me wants Hunter to win so that he can be done playing and come play COD with me. But the other part of me wants Hunter to keep getting to the boss and dying so I can laugh at him. What a good friend am I. Oh yeah, the best. The best of them. Hey, don't win. I want you to keep dying. There will be a time limit for me uh, for when I stop streaming. Um... And if I hadn't known how easy, easier the the mirror temple was, I may have done it yesterday. If I ever lost a uh, taste, I uh, no, I didn't lose my taste. I mean, I lost my appetite. I would probably just starve myself. I wouldn't feel motivated to eat. My auntie, she has no taste buds. Uh, she had something happen to her, and she lost the ability to taste. And it's sad, yeah, but like, you know, she, she's, it's more about the, the consistency of food at that point, you know, like, it is sad, but like, she, she loves consistencies of food rather than the taste, and, you know, she's trying to make good of a, of a bad situation. Yeah, but they can't do anything, I didn't see any marks, uh, so they couldn't. Wait, what's sus? It was uh, the session after the therapist wanted a one-on-one -on -one with me. 
and wanted to remove my parents from the room. I don't stop talking, take me to therapy. Yeah. Yeah, okay, yeah, that's, that's fucked up, man. Yeah, that's fucked up. Kiva, welcome in. Oh, you finished streaming? Welcome, welcome. Everyone, this is Kiva. She's a new streamer. I tried to help her out the other day, but I, uh... The issue she was having, it wasn't... I've always wanted to go there. Oh no, I was trying to... <laughs> <laughs> Welcome in, Kiva. I like that clip. The, the fall damage in Elden Ring from the horse, from Torrent, is very, very interesting, I would say, for the least. How was your stream, though? What were you streaming, by the way? Hey, Player Jacob, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it. Welcome in, welcome in. I don't think I've ever, like, introduced myself to everyone as you guys came in from the raid. Um, I am a completionist streamer. I'm doing games to 100%. And that primarily means achievements. But if there's other things, like these golden berries, I'll do them. Uh, but I'll only do them so for a certain amount of time before I move on to my next game. However, I am still doing them off stream. I'll be getting them all off stream and, and uh, you know, really pushing to get true completion in, in most games that I play. Let's just do it the proper way so I don't die. Um, but yeah, no. Welcome in everyone and welcome in Kiva. Uh, it was pretty good. What issues were you having Kiva? Oh, she was having a, there's a, there's a, there's a bot uh, command for gambling points. point Not channel points, but just uh, uh, points that you gather from watching a different point system. And the gambling wasn't working. I was streaming Hogwarts Legacy. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I popped in. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because I was lurking in your stream. I just couldn't remember what you're playing. <laughs> How is Hogwarts Legacy? Ah, fuck. I dashed too early. That's too bad. So Kiva, I don't know if you know, but this is uh, Golden Berries. I have to do the whole level without dying once. This is chapter six. So I've done one through five already uh, on the A side and there's A, B, C sides. The fact they that they didn't make dating an option still gets me. What, in the Hogwarts game? Who the hell would you even wanted to have dated? I don't think the... I don't think they were really wanting to go for like a dating aspect in the... in the game, considering it's meant to be about magic and not really so much dating. Like, if there was uh, characters from the movies and the books... the... the... you know, the actual Harry Potter books, maybe I could see that, but like... Eh. I don't see any issue with no dating in, in it. I can all, yeah, awesome. I love uh, the game so far, but I thought you could date someone low down. The plant girl. You'd want to date the plant girl? No, nah, because it was a thing me and Sebi would uh, live our gay dreams with our animals in our... What? You'd date Draco? Really? Draco of all people. Like, I could understand if you said, like, Ron Weasley or something, or Neville. Neville Longbottom. I, I'm convinced Neville Longbottom was the true chosen one in the Harry Potter series. What does everyone think of that? Does ever, anyone else uh, agree or disagree with that? I, I think Harry Potter was actually the wrong choice. I think Neville did way more technically in the, uh, in the, in the fall of, uh, of he who shall not be named. <laughs> uh, then Harry did, to be perfectly honest. Not, not overall law, but just towards the end. You know, the, the, the whole prophecy thing was about who killed Voldemort. And, uh, it wasn't Harry. So, like, that's why I think, uh, Neville is probably actually the true chosen one. Literally, I'm the stereotype. I'm a Hufflepuff who crushes on Slytherin. Oh, I see. That's touched on in the books. 
right, right, right. I misread your message. I thought you said bonks for some reason. I got my cord for my headphones right in front of my eyes, and sometimes some words get... Phew. Hey, Crazy Pie, thank you so much for the follow. Thank you, thank you. I didn't realize you weren't already following, but thank you so much for the follow. Uh, yeah, I suppose, but it would be nice if they had option, but I kind of heard about uh, the whole controversial stuff going on, and I want to stay out of that. Yeah... There's a lot of controversy going around it, and to be perfectly honest, I don't know if the devs thought there would be... Thought there would be uh, controversial stuff, but um, but uh, I think if there was dating in the game, the controversy would be worse, you know? The controversy is dumb in of itself, to be perfectly honest. It's just a, it's just a game. Why are people so mad? <laughs> if you know that meme. But, um, but, yeah, no, I, I think that the, the whole controversy, if there was dating as well, that, oh, shit. Oh, I'm dead. I think would have just added to the issue, rather than, you know, fixing it, or assisting it. Well, why can't I date X person? You know, it just adds so many layers of annoyancy. I think people should just enjoy the video games as they want to enjoy them. There are lots of people out there who like video games that I don't like. And a good example of that is uh, Kingdoms of Amalur Re-Reckoning. Now, do I think those people have terrible taste? Maybe. But, like, do I respect their right to like the game? Sure. Why not? It is what it is. I don't need to convince anyone of anything. I'm just playing a video game, man. Hey, Syllabus, welcome in. I used to be a Ravenclaw when I was a kid. Uh, as I got older, I turned into a Hufflepuff. What is the overall difference between them? Because I read... I, I read that the difference is, like... Courage... Uh, courage, empathy, intelligence, and cunning. But, like... Is that really the only difference between them? Like, is... Can... Can someone not be all of those things? I have the worst taste. Let's go. For, forget you were... Forgot you were streaming. No worries, dude. It's all good. Thank you, Mr. Mod. For forgetting I was streaming. <laughs> ah, useless. <laughs> Uh, yeah, exactly. I think as people grow older, they... I think more people kind of convert to... Shit, I was not paying attention. And this is part of the reason why I want to do the Golden Berries off stream. Is because I can, like, not have half my attention elsewhere. When, like, you got to do the whole level perfectly. But I am... This is my last stream of it. And I when I do farewell Golden Berry, I will stream that. But just know... That I probably will not be talking to chat at all throughout the entire thing. I will play it as if I've as I've been practicing it, and uh, will do it without much uh, conversation. But just be aware of that when I do go to do it on stream. Uh, but yeah, no. Uh, Ravenclaw is very smart. I don't know, lol. Gryffindor Courage, Ravenclaw, Smart, Slytherin Cunning, Hufflepuff, Empathy. Yeah, but like, couldn't someone be like all of those things? Or is it like, you are like 0.1% more intelligent than you are empathetic, <laughs> you know? Like, I read all seven books in middle school, which was like seven years ago. It's your most defining trait. Yeah, but like, what if you don't have a most defining trait? That's what I'm saying. <laughs> what if you are just like equally all of those things? What happens? I'm sure that like it would. I'm sure that there's probably some nuance to it more than just your most defining trait. I understand it in the fictional world. I completely understand it. I, I get why it works that way. It's just part of me thinks that people could be more than just one. Like that section I just did there, where I had to jump up through the hole in the ground. I wasn't. I haven't been looking at the screen while that's been happening for like the last four attempts so i gotta i've gotta like actually pay attention 
are awesome. I love the books, but I've only ever read the first uh, one and not all of it. I recently watched all the movies. I want to watch all the movies in my uh, Discord. I want to I want to go through them, uh, have a movie night once a week or once every fortnight and, and get through all the movies. Uh, but I'm sure the book has a lot of portrayed... It's a lot portrayed more than the movies described. Yeah, it's really hard. Isn't the... Um, isn't the Order of the Phoenix, like, 300 pages long and they only use, like, realistically, one-fourth of the content from the book? Or, like, 600 pages long or something? Yeah, okay, I gotta look at the screen there. Most of the books are, like, 600 minimum. Yeah, okay, there you go. I don't know, th I, I already said I don't remember, I never read the books. So, like, you're gonna have to forgive me if I get exact things wrong about the books. <laughs> I liked reading books when I was in school, but, like, I just never really... I don't know, if the book was too big, I never read it, you know? I was intimidated by big books, when realistically they were... just, in a sense, five smaller books, you know? Oh no, down first, okay. But yeah, I remember hearing about that. Uh, yeah, the books are better described. Uh, keep in mind, Harry Potter was Slytherin, but he asked for Gryffindor. Yeah, that's true. But like, is Harry more cunning than than uh, courageous? I'm assuming courageous is Gryffindor, right? Because you got to also remember, just because they're in Gryffindor doesn't mean they're good people, or just because they're in Slytherin doesn't mean they're bad either. Like, look at Peter Pettigrew from the from the movies. He was in Gryffindor, and he was like probably the worst character, like most evil character, second to uh, Voldemort, purely for the fact of what he did. You know, Harry was a dumbass. Yeah, yet it was going to be put in Slytherin anyway. You could argue it's because of, uh, you know, the spoilery aspect, which I won't say. Um, but still, it is very uh, much... It is very much... Um, uh, something that is should be kept in mind. You know? The movie of Aragon. I've never heard of it. Aragon? I've only read them though through once. Need to read them again. Watch the movies heaps though. Yeah, I, I've watched the movie several times as a kid, but I've just, I want to rewatch them now as an adult. I want to watch them with an adult eye and see if there's anything I can like see as an adult that I couldn't see as a child. Much like how watching uh, The Simpsons as an adult is a different experience to watching them as a child. There's just a lot of jokes there that went right over my head. Oh, that was lucky. Alright, we're up to the boss. We should totally do a movie analysis together. For sure. I need to rewatch them though, so... I do want to do movie nights in my Discord, and I, I'm, I'm kind of working out a, a date and time to set that up. I want to set it up so that most people can get in. But if you're not in the Discord, come join. There's the link. If the link... I don't think the link's broken, but... If the link is broken, definitely just let me know. Um, you have to clicky-click a few things before you can see all of the Discord. It's not just empty, I, I assure you. Um, I love how thin we get as we drop down here. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, it's, uh, it is something I want to do. I love, I, I really critically look at things these days. We watched Puss in Boots in my Discord the other day, actually. Oh, God, I'm do this. Probably just land on this. I can just drop here, right? Yeah, I can. Okay. Nice. Nice. 
Okay, now we need to go underwater. Problem is like 3 a.m. for me, Lamau. Yeah, no, we would probably start it. Uh, seven, five, two and a half hours ago, we probably would have started the what to watch it. Whatever the time is now where you are, uh, two and a half hours ago from right now is when we would like start to watch the movies. Your Discord is so scuffed. I know. <laughs> I know. There is uh, quite a bit in there. Dude, why do I lose my momentum sometimes there? I don't understand. Like, I'm on the block. It's not like I'm... Alright, let me practice on this guy, actually. Alright, so I need to move with him if I want to... Okay. Oh, shit. I think I see now. Yeah, okay. <laughs> the Final Fantasy XIV is like the role that gives channels as well as the heart. No, the only reason why it does that is because um, if people came in and they only wanted to see Final Fantasy XIV, then they would still get the rest of the Discord. The fourteen section is just like a bonus section, but sometimes people come in and they just want to see the 14 section. That hasn't happened for a while, and I might change that up, but like, it just saves them having to do it twice, you know? Though I guess there's nothing there saying that they have to do it once either, you know? Sometimes it breaks when you like spam the emotes, uh, you know, the, the reaction roll, but like, if that happens, that's... I don't expect people to like click, 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 click the thing over and over again, you know? It's a preventable bug by, you know, common sense. Don't hate me for this, but... Oh, you fucking asshole. Alright, glasses are off. Ah, uh, It actually might work out better. It means I can't read your damn messages properly. <laughs> Plus, I'm working mostly off muscle memory. <laughs> Removing my damn glasses. <laughs> I haven't played a game without my glasses in years. It is actually kind of blurry. But luckily, things are big enough that I don't have to precisely look at anything. Oh god, I can't read that. I can see the third word says looks... I, if I'm, I'm not going to lean in. If I was to read that, I have to lean in. Looks like Hunter. Died in Celeste. It's fine. I've got muscle memory. That's all I need. Although, I don't know. I'm not doing too bad right now. You know, there's a whole thing, a whole science around focusing less on something hard and... You end up doing it. Let's just speed through this. Fuck it. It's like a whole science around it. I wonder if I can just... Oh. Yeah, I can. I can just do that. Okay, that saves me some time. I removed his glasses. Your whole science around overthinking. <laughs> so I'm helping. Well, like, this is uh, the thing, right? And baseball players do it a lot. Before they throw the ball, they look away. And the reason you look away is because if you if you hard focus too hard on one thing without a break, you'll actually fuck it up more often than if you just take a, a second to, to um, look away and distract yourself for that moment. That's why baseball players look away before they throw the ball. That's where I first heard about it. I looked more into it and like the whole like actual science behind it is I, I can't repeat that, but like the the uh, the baseball one is a good enough analogy for everyone to understand and for me to be able to uh, talk about, you know.
It's why, like, you go away from a game when you're doing trying to do something hard. You, you put it down for a couple hours and then you come back and you do it first try. It's like, what the fuck? We've all had that. I assume most people have had that. And it's like, how the hell can I do it on my first try back? And it's just because we needed a break. And it is part of the reason why I want to do the golden berries off stream. You know, I can have those breaks and not just continually do the thing. I'll be in my Discord, um, like probably in a voice channel, talking, uh, talk, like talking to people while I'm doing the goldens. But like talking to someone and reading chat is two different things, you know. And even then, if there is one that's really hard, like farewell, I probably will just. Uh, not talk to anyone. Like I said, when I do farewell on stream, it'll probably just be me and the game. I didn't know that. You didn't know that, Syllabus? Oh, wait. Damn, I was thinking of playing a game with my glasses of... With my glasses of in the off in the future on stream. Eva, don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> it's not worth it. My redeem is bad. I didn't even put on a timer. I'm so stupid. Uh, when was that done? Four minutes ago. Okay, six minutes to go. I didn't know that. Feel free to put them back on. Uh, I got my laugh. No, nah, it's fine. Ten minutes is the timer. Uh, I can see when you did the redeem, so that's how I'm gauging the time. You did it four minutes ago, so we're good. Did you not grab that? Was I not close enough? I'm still waiting for uh, Syllabus to do one Golden Berry. Golden Berry when? <laughs> Code Vein when? <laughs> Code Vein soon, actually. So that'll be my next big game. I'm gonna play Scorn. I thought I was out of the. I thought I was out of the feather. <laughs> Why? Ah, oh, just depending on what you're playing, you know. I think the redeem is fine, but like just outrightly playing without glasses on. I don't know. You need the glasses for a reason. Not like I'm playing without glasses all the time. But if you have it as a redeem, yeah, sure, go for it. Like, but I wouldn't recommend. <laughs> trying to do something intensely hard without glasses on. In about 170 years. Damn, man. You know the first level is the absolute easiest one? To get it for? Just do it. Just get one. Do the thing. I'm a PC gamer, Lamau. Wait. The fact I am nearsighted, so taking my glasses off has no effect on me. Oh yeah, if you're nearsighted, yeah, for sure. I'm farsighted. I need my glasses when I play games or read books. Driving cars, perfectly fine. Cars, trucks, easy peasy. But like... Playing a video game, kind of need my glasses on. I don't leave more than two to five streets. I don't leave more than two to five feet from my monitor. I don't even know how far away I am from mine, but I'm at comfortable distance. My monitor isn't too big. My dash. How about no? <laughs> I just. Okay, lol, I have my laptop for a monitor, but I stream on PS5. Oh, you stream on PS5. Is that what you're playing um, Elden Ring on? Nice, nice. Is there any issues or bugs on PS5? I heard that most issues were on um, 
were on PC, if I remember correctly. I played it on PC, but I never came across too many bugs. I shouldn't have started stared at the sun. You know what happened to me when I was a kid? My oldest brother, he had a laser pointer, right? And he's like, if you look inside the la- Fuck, I'm dead. Wait, am I dead? Fuck, I'm dead. <laughs> he said, if you look inside the laser pointer, you'll see a, a, a hot lady. And I, I'm almost convinced that it's either way, because my, my glasses aren't for both my eyes, it's only for one of my eyes. Because one of my eyes can see perfectly fine. I have 20-10 vision, as I like to put it. Um, I'm almost convinced that I only need glasses because he made me look inside this laser pointer. For I swear to God, I swear to God, like 15 times as a six-year-old. I'm almost convinced that's the only reason why I need to wear glasses. The laser, like, fucked up my eyeball. Or, uh... <laughs> or, it's either that, or my eyes were fucked, and I somehow did laser eye surgery on one of my eyes perfectly. As a kid. <laughs> Shit, I wasn't looking. Uh, no, there's bugs. Uh, okay, time to put my glasses back on. I can actually read and watch, look at things properly. No, there's no bugs as far as I have seen, uh, except one, but they patched it. Uh, don't call out my ADHD ass. Oh, right, the staring at the sun. Uh, I would literally stare at the sun until I saw was black. Don't know how I am not blind. Damn, dude, that's fucked up. I don't think I'd use this emotion. And sunken ore. Wait, what? I didn't think I'd use this em emote. Do you mean emote? Why the fuck are you shooting at me? What, because I had a laser pointer poked in my eye by my brother when I was six. Yeah, yeah blame me. Not the 15 year old, uh, not the 15 year old teen trying to fuck with his six year old brother. <laughs> yeah, well, you know what? I got, I got my own guns. Bring it, fucker. <laughs> shoot him down. Everyone shoot Syllabus. Fuck the guy. <laughs> being straight caused my eye problems. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Imagine being straight now. In cutscenes, the color... Is anyone here colorblind? I know Sortex is. He's not here right now, but I know he is. Uh, in cutscenes, the color of the hair kind of changed low, so it wasn't big. Oh, right, in uh, Elden Ring. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. In the few cutscenes it has in the game. 12 years age gap between my dibbling, damn, sibling. Was your, was your brother an asshole as well? Brother, uh, sorry, not brother, your sister. Oh, no, you're the older one. I'm stupid. Brain no function properly. You weren't an asshole to your sister, though, were you? No, we have spoiled her. I see. She ruled the house for real. Only girl child in the whole damn house. <laughs> hey, what's with the knives, huh? I misread Sunken Ore's message, alright? You wanna go, bro? I'm a good boy. Yeah, for sure you are. Yeah, you could have fooled me. <laughs> oh. Ooh. I bought her a Switch. You didn't buy me, Switch Bastard. 
That's my switch, huh? I want to switch. Bastards, I tell you, every time. <laughs> I bought her an Elsa plush. <laughs> Am I the only one who's an only child? Because normally I'm the only one in the group. I... I have three brothers. I think most people here have siblings, but you, I don't think you're the only one here who's an only child. I think that there are a few people here, just not talking about it. But I, my family was messed up, man. That's why I'm glad I'm an adult and I'm out of that. My family's still messed up. Oh god, I almost died there. Hey Granny, I'm here again. It's been a while. I'm getting tired. It's okay. <laughs> Devil, you've ever... You've heard about my family? Well, yeah, I have, yes. Also, it's I'm gonna... I don't know if you're there for it, but I actually prefer to be called Hunter. If that's all good. Hey, I actually got on top of it. Neat. I put my foot down on my birthday stream and I said I'd rather just be called Hunter from now on. So you're normal then, Hunter. Normal? What do you mean? I was the only child until I was 13. I was the third child in my family. I guess it is kind of expensive. My aunt and grandmother are forcing me to reconnect with my father even though they knew what he did. No. <laughs> I would just say no. I'm sorry, but no. If, look, you don't have to do anything you don't want to. That's what it means to be an adult. You don't have to listen to your own parents. That's virtually, to my understanding, what it is to be an adult. It's one aspect of it. Is when you let go of whatever control your parents might hold over you. Because, like, yeah, if your parents are good, it's nice having them there and, and listening to them and and taking in whatever information they want to give you. But, like, in my experience, for, from an overbearing father and even to a, a lesser degree mother, it's Hunter of 777 Devils. Okay, buddy. I know, if, uh, but I feel guilty if I don't. You don't have to feel guilty. Not at all. Made it. Oh my god, I almost fucked it up again. It's so hard. It's so annoying. But thank you, big man. Thank you. You may rest. You sleep well with your tongue out. I'm suspicious of people with normal families. Kek W, there is no such thing as a normal family. What are you talking about? And if there is, to be perfectly honest, good for them. I, I am glad that, you know, there are less... There are fewer people in the world with... With, uh, terrible parents, you know, in the, in the long run, which is what I would actually rather hope for. I missed. Oh gosh, she shot it. Normal, what is that? <laughs> it's easy for me to feel guilty even if I get angry. It diffuses almost instantly and turns into guilt or sadness. Look. Sunken Ore, you're still young, okay? And that is a good thing. You have a you have a lot a long way to go in life and you know, I'm not too much older than you, but I can tell you this much that you never, ever, ever have to do anything you don't want to. It doesn't matter if they're family, it doesn't matter if they're friends, it doesn't matter if they're your best friend, or your lover, or, you know... It doesn't matter. What you want to do should be paramount over all else. What other people want you to do is secondary. Now, sometimes what people want you to do is good, you know? You got a job and people want you to do things, you do it and, you know, you get money for it. And it's like, okay, cool. There's a mutual beneficial reason for me, for me to listen to what other people want me to do. But, like, outrightly forgiving... People 
especially if they were monsters, I don't think that's... I think that's a big ask of someone. Because it's not that you should forgive them. You should be willing to forgive them, but you should only forgive them if they change. And that's the big driving difference here. Your grandparents are asking you to forgive them regardless of them changing. That's not how this works. You don't get to hurt me and then expect me to just forgive you for no reason. You have to show me you've changed. No. Also apologize, not them. Yeah, exactly. No, I, I completely disagree with that. If you were hurt, you don't need to apologize. If they don't want to change or apologize, even lying apologies, which is better than no apology, then no, I, you have no reason to ever interact with them again if you don't wish to. So I think, I, I think, you know, your grandparents have a good heart, but like sometimes you got to let go. And there's a, there's a great uh, image I've seen of this before. Um, if you hold onto a rope and the other person is on the other end and they're causing you harm by pulling on the rope, you know, you have rope wrapped around your arm or your hand, it's going to hurt you. And sometimes you just got to let go to let go of that pain. And that is... The best metaphor I can give you. If they're not doing anything to help with the situation, you gotta let go. They claimed I abandoned them. No. No. You turning 18 and leaving home is exactly what it was meant to happen. You are a child becoming an adult. What do they expect you to do? Stay there forever? No. It's, it's expected for you to leave them. Now, the degree of how much you leave them, you know, how much you want to talk to them after that, is dependent on how well they raised you. And they raised you absolutely shit. They do not... You as an adult, you have your own self-integrity. You decide for yourself how much you want to interact with them. I didn't talk to my mother for two years because she was... did things in my life that I could not let go of. And it wasn't until I heard some form of an apology from her, a truthful apology from her, that I decided to talk to her again. You, are, you cannot be held to do anything that you don't want to do. Unless, of course, you know, law and all that. You know, there is there is lines to be drawn here. But for interpersonal relationships, you can do what you so wish. And no one has a right to tell you otherwise. So, I'm, I'm going to leave it there. I do hope that, uh, that, you know... Look, if you ever want to talk about it one-on-one -on -one with me, I know this is on stream and everything, but... If you want to talk about this one-on-one, -on -one, I'm, I'm happy to have a chat with you about it. Let's leave it here. and But just know... I, I at the very least want to let you know you did nothing wrong, okay? <laughs> yeah, yeah, we are. So, you did nothing wrong and it... Nobody should ask anything of you. Especially if you did nothing wrong. I am up to the end though now, Marine. So if I die here... I think if I die here, I'll leave it here, but let's hope I can get this golden berry. This is my last stream, and if I do get this golden berry later on, I'll put in the Discord. Uh, definitely be in there to see that. But, yeah. I think I am... I am ready to end this level. Let's see how we go. And this goes for anyone else, too. That if you feel like anyone is trying to force something out of you or do something for their own gain, it's it's not on. You, you shouldn't have to listen to anything you don't feel you need to. Especially in interpersonal relationships. I pressed diagonal. It didn't go diagonal. <laughs> uh, I, I'm going to go back and look at that, but I could have sworn I pressed diagonal. It's okay. All right. Thank you, everyone, for being here. We kind of got... I got a bit heated at the end there. Not in a bad way, but I feel for you because I've been through this and people... And look, I, I think your grandparents are... are 
sound like lovely people and they only want the best, but sometimes the best thing to do is just let go, okay? And if that means letting go for two, three, five years, that's what you gotta do to move on with your life and make yourself better first. So this goes out to everyone. If anyone's trying to force you or tell you what to do, you don't have to listen to anyone but yourself. Now there's a, there's a narcissistic view on that, but definitely if you feel like what you're, you're doing is right, that's what matters. If you don't think you're doing something out of any malicious intent or any negativity, that's the most important thing. You're just trying to get through life the best you can. And don't let anyone tell you that you're doing wrong by that. They also claimed me, uh, claimed me on their taxes and wouldn't help me with the FAFSA. So I, I don't know what that is. So I was almost kicked out of... Really? That's fucked up. I have some fucked up situations. Most important is that you feel comfortable with the decisions you've made, whether they were positive or negative. Sometimes we don't know if the outcomes of our decisions will be good or bad. And that's, that's a dice roll we've got to take. And sometimes there is no good answer. Sometimes there's no good solution. Stuff for financial aid for college. Oh, I see. Okay. I, I think that's like a... That, that would be more of a uh, American term, or at least I've never seen it used here in Australia. We just get, uh, we just get study allowance here. Um, but yeah, no. Sometimes there's no good decision. Sometimes you just got to make the best of a, of a bad situation. But, and sometimes you do have to be selfish. Sometimes you do. But that's, that's in si really dire situations, more or less. It's why when we watch a show about zombies and there's different settlements and people are killing each other for resources, we can kind of understand why they're doing it. You know? It's a selfish take, but we can understand why they're doing it because, you know, it's it, it, someone's going to die and it'd be better if my people could live. And, it, and that's, a, that's a dramatic example, but it's, it's the point that matters. There's a saying in life for lifeguards. When they train you to be a lifeguard, if someone's drowning, you approach them with your feet out first. Not your body, not your hands, your feet first. And if they don't calm down and they and what people do when they're drowning, they grab onto whatever they can and try to pull themselves up. But as a consequence, if it's a person, they push them down into the water. And the person who's drowning is so unable to even pull themselves up out of the water with another person that two people end up drowning instead of one. So the rule for lifeguards is you come in with your legs first, and if the person isn't cooperating with your commands or listening or is going to calm down for you to be able to save them, instead of two people drowning, one person will drown. And that is a selfish thing to do, and it's a horrible thing to do, but it's... It's... It's how it'll end at the worst case scenario, and that is the same throughout life. You need to take care of yourself first. And sometimes what you need to do is something selfish. And as long as it's not something that's outrightly maliciously trying to hurt someone else, even if someone is hurt by it, you need to take care of yourself first. So I want everyone to keep that in mind, all right? I want you all to take care of yourselves at the very most. Coming from a stranger from Australia, take care of yourselves, you know? Make sure you take care of yourselves. And when you take care of yourself, you end up taking care of those around you. And it, and it can blossom into a great relationship with friends and people. You know, I've done this already, which is why I can give you this advice. Like, I'm, I can only convey to you my experiences. And maybe my experiences can help you make your own experiences and then you can convey that to someone else. And it just blossoms into a better world, you know? Like, I think that people are greater than what they think they are. So... My rant is over. <laughs> I'm going to end stream. <laughs> Take care of yourselves. All right. Promise me that. Uh, walking a blurred line, uh, trying to keep both sides of the family, yet me. Dad is trying to keep me from my mom. Yeah, look, it's it's a toughie. And I'm and sunken all. I'm, I'm more than happy to talk to you one on one about it. OK, this uh, there's more shitty things uh, that he did, but I'll leave it there. OK, OK. Yo, as a swim TA, I know about what this is. Uh, we were instructed to throw our tube under them. If they can't do it with a tube, then we have to decide whether or not it's safe to rescue. Exactly. Thanks, Dr. Hunt. I can't wait till the next therapy session. It's not therapy session. It's not. It's just a conversation. 
Because you know what a good conversation is? A good discussion is? A good discussion is where we can all walk away learning something new. Even if that's 5% of the conversation or even 1%. I'm not a therapist and I don't think this is therapy. I think this is just experiences conveyed. You know? So, <laughs> for now, <laughs> I am tired and I think I will be getting this golden berry off stream. Unfortunately, I would have loved to have gotten it right there, but you know, I'm just not quite there yet. I'm going to practice that section and try and do it. You don't have time. <laughs> just don't have time or money. Sunken all, if you think you need therapy, when you can get it, you know, with time and money, definitely take it. If, if you believe it's what you need, because I think therapy only works when the person who needs it decides that they need it. You know, if someone forces you to do it and you don't want to do it, I don't think it's going to work. So if you believe you need it and when you can go for it, definitely take it. Definitely take it. Okay. All right. I hope you all do well. You know, love yourselves. You know. All of us here, I, I, I consider you all my friends and I take care of my friends. I want my friends to do good. So, <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Millie, thank you for the follow. Uh... Millie, welcome in. Vinless, welcome in. This raid is just a demo. Be sure to download the full version. Welcome Raiders. All right. All right, all right, here's the deal. I will do one more. One more. <laughs> I will do one more run. Oh my god. Welcome in Raiders to my stream. If you don't know me, my name is Devil Hunter or my name is Hunter. I am a completion streamer. I 100% games on stream. Now that means mainly the achievements, but if there is extra things to do, like these golden berries right here, I will do them. Um, and, uh, it's perfect timing you're here, Demo, because I was just about to wrap up stream. Absolutely perfect timing. I just had a heart-to-heart -heart with my stream, with my, with my, with my, uh, with my chat, and you've just graced me with your, with your presence of a raid. <laughs> I am Australian. Yes, apricots. I think this is your first time in my stream. I am an Australian. Uh, I, I am working on a VTuber model right now, but I am a PNG streamer right now. Um, this is the biggest curveball I've ever been thrown. Hey, you know, like just because I don't type like an Australian doesn't mean I ain't, you know? My, uh, I, I can say my writing is much more appropriate than my, my, my words for sure. But if we don't know Demo, people from my, uh, before the raid, everyone who was already in my stream, let's give Demo a shout out, a shout out. Let's, let's see if we can find a, let's hope we can get a, uh, a clip of him screaming at me. Let's see. Let's find out. Or if it's the one where he throws his controller, I'll, I'll like that too. Ah, oh, it's neither. Wait, wait, what? But this is a good clip. Here we go. <laughs> yeah, Melania. Hey, Demo, what? did you know Melania is the Blade of Mikola? Did you know that? I don't know if you knew that, but I know that. Did you know that? <laughs> How dare you not say down under ever? Because <laughs> I'm not down under, I'm upside down. What do you mean? And I, bullshit? and Apricots, I think I have told you I'm Australian when I was in your stream watching you play Spongebob. So, uh, hmm, interesting dynamic right there. Did you get the one for... One for the road? Oh, yeah. Uh, take a cold one for the road. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I get you. I get you. One more attempt to watch Hunter fail. Yeah, we're all going to watch me... We're all going to watch me fail one more time. Demo. She is the Blade of Mikola. Yes, I have been reminded probably at least 50 times. At least 50 times? No. A hundred, surely. Demo, you son of a bitch. I was about to wrap up stream. I just had a heart to heart with my chat and now you raid me and now I feel obligated to try and uh, do this golden berry one final time. You bastard. We are up to chapter six of uh, seven or technically eight plus uh, chapter nine, which is one posture check. All right, Vinless. Vinless, thank you so much for the follow. 
And apricots, thank you for the follow as well. The victory attempt. Yeah, I don't know about that. Hydrate? All right, all right, all right. You're welcome. You son of a bitch. Unlike you, Demo, I have a cap on my hydrate. So none of my clips are of, you, of me screaming at you. <laughs> I gave 25 hydrates to Demo. Weak. You should have been there when he was doing Path of Pain. He came back after getting water. A hundred plus hydrates. The man turned into a water balloon. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I died me. I'll do one more. That was not far at all. I'll do one more. I'll do one more. But this is my final attempt, okay? Unless I die in this first area, this will be my, my final attempt. Seems that you... That you are. Uh, I am afraid of Water Hunter. <laughs> I was there for... Oh, you were there for Path of Pain? Path of Pain was amazing. I love the part where Demo got up and left his chair for... Unknown reasons. I think it's because the concrete cracked. Oh, shit. Oh, I thought he was coming straight for me. <laughs> 30 minutes. I would love just a clip of Demo... Drinking water straight for 30 minutes. Like, he gets a thousand redeems and he just has to sit there drinking water. Turning into a true water balloon. That would make my... That would make my life, honestly. I, I could die happy knowing that, uh... Demo turns into a water balloon on stream. Uncensored. <laughs> I should check my, my floor <laughs> under the rug. Uh, for anyone not, who hasn't played this game, this is chapter uh, 6 in Celeste, A-side. Um, so if you haven't played it, just know that I'm going through, attempting to go through the entire level in one life. So I'm skipping any cutscenes there are, but uh, you know, if you don't want to be spoiled too much on the game, definitely jump out now. Because um, there is a section towards the end, which is kind of, uh, kind of nifty. Um... I like the part where Demo finally got past the path the pain and then almost died to the mini bosses. I looked away when that happened. I came back and he was finished path the pain. And I was like, damn it. I was hoping he died there. <laughs> because when I did path the pain, I died to those two, the ambush to the two enemies. And I had to do the whole path the pain again. And so I was really hoping Demo went through the same thing I did. Uh, I got back to the end of path the pain in like five minutes, but like he, uh, it would have been funny if I saw Demo suffer that as well. And uh, if he would have died after breaking his controller, I'd have stuck crying. <laughs> oh, he's fine. He's fine. Demo's a, Demo's a good boy. Demo's a very, very good man. Also, I, I haven't even talked about it in my own stream. If you don't know, if you haven't heard it from Demo or Rhoda, and definitely not myself, because I haven't even talked about it, tomorrow... Myself and five others, including Demo and Serelda, are going to be starting a Sons of the Forest playthrough. Six people in one world. It's going to be hell. So uh, definitely be there for that. That's going to... I've never played the Forest games, but um, I am just going to be absolute chaos. I will become Heath Ledger himself in, uh, in the forest. Everyone will fear me. Spears will come out of nowhere. I will, I will lead the, the mutants to the group. <laughs> I'm going to cause so much chaos. <laughs> You'd break your whole setup. <laughs> Demo just picks up the camera and just yeets it across the room. <laughs> he goes through the green screen and then the camera becomes invisible. <laughs> oh, why'd I do that? I could have... Yeah, I am so excited for tomorrow. I am going to bed extra early. In fact, I'm taking... I'm going to make sure I, I wake up at the... Oh my god, I got... Yeeted. I'm going to be making sure I, I'm waking up well before the stream because I do not want to be late. I'm going to bed. Lovely you're coming here to raid with demo stream. No worries, Vin. Take care of yourself. I will catch you another time. It was good seeing you again, friend. This is my final attempt. So, we have gotten pretty far in the level. I think we're nearly halfway through. When I get to the end, I will just say I'm going to just not look at chat or talk 
and try to hard focus the hard part. Demo knows the hard part. And anyone else who has played this knows the hard part. I was practicing it for a good while, but I don't think I practiced it enough. Oh, I almost died there. Have, uh, Apricots, have you played Celeste? I know Demo has, and I know he, um... Oh, threaded the needle. Okay. It's Granny. Hey, Granny. Alright, this is not yet the hard part, but it's going to be in a second. I just need to get past this fall section. This is probably one of the best uh, platformers of our age. One of. If not the best. I highly recommend this game to people. I forget where I put it on my list though. Cool. Alright. I really need to make sure I don't die here. There we go. Nice skip there. Yeah, I, I saw that skip before and I was like, yeah, I need to use that. Alright, we're not yet up to the hard part. We've got two more rooms to go through. This water section and then... And then the big boy. The one that I probably died on the most, to be honest. I did a mirror temple pretty easily demo. Alright, here's the big boy. Oh. It's so ill, but we... That's the last attempt, I think. I was about to wrap up as you came in, but... Ah, oh, that big boy. I need to practice that. I really do, because... Uh, the momentum being on top of those things is very, very strange. So... You don't have a lot of time before you reach the first crystals, and the way you move with the momentum is you've got to walk in the direction and jump. In the direction. So, like... You need to be able to be further back on the block, and then jump over the things, run back, jump over the things, and there's three spikes to jump over. <laughs> Thank you, Millie. Thank you so much. I, uh... I've gotten past that point, and I've gotten pretty far into the... into the, uh... level. Uh, I got- I have gotten all the way to this part, the very end. We just died just before this. If we had gotten past it, we would have been here, but... Uh, if we can beat this, then this part, like, is so easy. And then we'll have the golden berry. For everyone to, uh, take a look at my final stats before I end stream. These are all my stats of the game. This is... Uh, this is what I did throughout the game. Uh, level 1 has a lot of deaths because I went for the dashless berry. Which is why there's 22 out of 20, and the rest are 19, 26, 30, 32, and so on. Um, but yeah, Celeste has been an absolute ride. I really love this game. I'm going to re recommend it to people uh, th through time. And really, really go for these golden berries off stream. Let me take a look at something. I want to tell you what I rank it in my overall all games of all time. Uh, it is ranked... I think it was 10th, actually, if I'm remembering. 8th. It is 8th. It is my 8th favorite game of all time now. I've been playing too many good games. So next stream... Well, not next stream. Next stream tomorrow will be Sons of the Forest. And then the next day after that, I'll be starting Scorn. And Scorn is going to be... <laughs> Scorn. <laughs> so we'll see how that goes. I really want to experience Scorn. and I want to really see what it's all about. Yeah, Scorn. I'm looking forward to it. Alright. Now, to raid out, yesterday I promised I would raid someone. Let's see if they're online. If they're online, I will go for them. Butterfingers suggested them to me, I believe. Tone Deaf Leopard. They are not online currently. Okay. Wait, did I, did I spelled that right? Tone Deaf Leopard. Yeah, okay, yeah. The capitalization doesn't matter. Alright. Raid Blazon. Blazon? Oh, excuse me. Water went down the wrong way. Who is online? Let's take a look. Let's take a look-see. 
I don't really even have anyone online. Lotus is online. We haven't raided him for a while. But, uh, if anyone has any suggestions, is anyone from the Cool Kids table online that I'm not following yet? I'd love to... I'd love to go raid one of them. I don't think I've raided anyone other than Mondo and, you know, Demo, Rodar. <laughs> You're a cool... You are a Cool Kid, Sunken Ore. Not that I have on my list, no. Hmm, okay. Well, how about we raid just a random raid? I do love me some random raids. Let's look... What category should we look for? How about some Hollow Knight? Let's take a look. Let's take a look at the Hollow Knight category. Can I send a recommendation? Yeah, if you got a recommendation, definitely. My favorite Aussie streamer, but maybe not. <laughs> yeah, I, I saw I saw that they were on uh, Marine. But I, I love meeting new people. So if you have a recommendation, Sunken Ore, definitely. He's Aussie. GIF TV 97. Okay. Let me... Let me take a look. He's playing Overwatch 2. I'm not going to lie, Sunken Ore. I, uh, even in it's hard to have conversations with people playing uh, competitive multiplayers. I will keep down... I'll write him down for now. Okay, I have a list here of people I, I like to raid. But I, I want to maybe have a conversation with someone in a, in a single player game. Were we comping? Were we quick playing? I adore the vibes you- Oh, thank you, Ethan. Uh, Ethan, I- Oh, God! Scary Ryan, scary Ryan, scary Ryan. Sorry that. Yeah, yeah, I, I- I think he's going to be a bit too busy to have a conversation. I'd like to meet new people, but I- I would like to have a, a full-on conversation with them as well. Um, so let's- let's take a look at, um, let's take a look at Hollow Knight, uh, category. The hell? Oh, here it is. Let's take a look. Raids that I'm not raiding Asmongold. First playthrough. Ooh. Interesting. Not bad. I uh I like first playthroughs. It gives I like to talk to people about their thoughts on the game, you know, as they're starting to go through. I reckon. That seems alright. He's got <laughs> he's wearing a singlet though. I am, uh... Wait, do you guys... You don't, you don't call it single that's over there. <laughs> Piss off, Celibus. Alright, let's let's go for this guy. I, I think we could have a good conversation with him. He's currently in the sewers of Hollow Knight, so let's... Let's give him a shot. We'll give him a raid. And uh, see what he thinks of uh, Hollow Knight, because I'm interested. I, I, I love the game, and I'd like to see what this guy thinks. So, thank you everyone for being here. Demo, thank you so much for the raid. My god, we had so many people follow me this stream. I'm, I'm actually surprised that so many people came in. Apricots, thank you. Vinless, Millie, Crazy Pie, J uh, Player Jacob, Bread, you rated me as well. Swift, this, <laughs> I, I, it has been such a great stream. Thank you all for, be for being here. I hope uh, I hope you all do well, uh, you know. Kiva, thank you for coming in. I, I had a great conversation with you. I, I think that... Uh, I think you're doing well in your streams as well, and I'm, I'm excited to see more of it. I am getting tired, and I am rambling, so I'm going to end now. I hope to see you all tomorrow for Sons of the Forest, and yeah, it's it's been great. This has been such a great stream. I can't wait to start my next game and, and learn more about games, different individual games. Sons of the Forest hype. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Bad at fighting games. Should I 100%? Definitely. I, I think you should at least get, um, I think you should at least get the 112% in Hollow Knight, but maybe not all the achievements, you know? It d depends on what you want to do. Alright, I'll see you all later. The time is about to disappear anyway. I'll catch you all next time. Night night, have a good day, or morning, or afternoon. I don't know how temperatures work. I just know that Celsius has lower numbers than Fahrenheit, so it must be colder. Got it. Devil Seven Seven Hunter. Seven 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 Hunter. Hi. Devil Seven Hundred and Seventy Seven Hunter is raiding. Or the Devil 